reasonably late. Hello, everyone. Good morning. Good evening. Good afternoon. Good day. Oh my god, I keep forgetting that the camera is like different now. It's like different now. Hi, everyone. I'm so sorry that I'm an hour and 20 minutes late. <laughs> um, I am. I am chronically ill and cute and today i have been up been feeling very good but that's okay because i'm here now i'm gonna have a good time hope you guys are having a good day um you're gonna tell me i'm boring 0.5 seconds after starting after i told you i have a chronic illness and that i'm sick today that's low that's kind of low yikes um i hope you guys are all having a great day so far i'm excited we're gonna do we're gonna we're not finishing the island. We're not finishing the island. <laughs> but I think we're gonna get very close today. So today we're gonna do all the stuff that's left. We're gonna do villager interiors. Hi, Miss Pink, welcome in. Hi, everybody. I hope you're doing great. Hope you're doing great. Hair looks fancy blowing in the wind. Oh, thank you. 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 Um, doing all the stuff. Villager interiors, trying to get my villager pictures. The rest of the island. What's left? That's what we're gonna do. Hope you guys are having a great day so far. Like I just said, I like to let you guys know at the top of all of my streams that I am chronically ill and cute. I do have a chronic pain condition. I like to let you guys know this because I move around. I need to like get stuff. Sometimes I gotta take it easy. And this is especially important today because I'm not feeling that great today, but I'm excited to be here with you guys. You guys always make me feel better. So I'm excited to be here. And I like to let you guys know this because I want to be my most comfortable self during my streams and I want you guys to be your most comfortable self. Um, I'm glad you pushed it back. I woke up late. <laughs> good. All right. It all works out then. It always, it always works out. It's all good. It's all good. Um, you guys are all so sweet. Yeah, we got to check that posture too. Yeah, I'm going to, we're going to do the best I can. I'm going to do the best I can today. Hey, N. Fashionably. Thank you. I am fashionably late. It's fine. Hey Soap, hope you're doing good. I have like an advertisement on the side of my screen and it's like taking up all of my chat. Um, I hope you guys are all doing great today. I did not finish these beaches last night. So I'm deciding whether or not we want to, I we're probably gonna start with a villager interior and then like alternate things because I can't do all of the villager interiors back to back. Hey Lauren, what's up? Hope you're doing okay. What's up? No worries, I'm good. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Yeah, I think we're going to do a villager interior, do something else, villager interior, something else, just so I don't get sick of it, because I got sick of it last time, and, uh, yeah. Also, I don't have my headphones in today, so if the background music gets crazy or weird, someone's got to let me know. <laughs> you, you better let me know, guys. You best let me know. Uh, make sure you guys liked the stream, if you haven't already, to like the stream. Just woke up, but I'm tired. I feel that. I'm drinking my coffee now, though, so it's like... We're starting the day late, but it's okay. Thank you, guys. You guys are the best. You guys are the best. You are the best. I think we're gonna do Blue Bear's house first. I want some fun. Let's do some fun things. We'll do some fun. Um, And yeah, my goal is to finish the island tomorrow, because we have this stream and... This stream is like, oh my god, it's almost done. But tomorrow's stream is, stream doesn't end till it's done. So, I'll be done. I had my coffee, but I immediately laid back down. I feel that. The, they're actually not killing Isabel. We checked last night, it's at four stars. That's pretty good. That's pretty, that's not too bad. I thought it was going to be like two. I thought it was going to be way worse. Way worse. Um... You know what? Today's my day off, though, too, so I'm like, you know what? If I want to sleep in, I'm going to sleep in. What do I do? I like my BFF and she likes me back. Sounds like a winning situation right there. Sounds like a winning situation. Playing while watching... Oh, you're doing villager exteriors. Fun, 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 fun. Forgot to write down the kittens' names yesterday. Can you remind me what you named one of them? Uh, Funfetti. Whatever, whichever one you want to be Funfetti. How could it be too with such an amazing island, right? Oh, Stacy! Thank you for renewing your membership. Thank you for being a Slop Squad member for two months. Be sure to take care of yourself. Thank you guys. You guys are really 
always understanding, except for that person who was telling me it was boring right off the bat. Um, it's fine. You guys are always very understanding about, um, oh, this is not what I want to do. About me, like, not feeling well. You guys are always, like, really good about it. Like, chill. It's just really nice. Perhaps because I mention it every time, too, so it's not, like, a surprise. Like, it's, it's not, like, a surprise that I'm like, hey, by the way, I ate a granola bar, which is, like, about all I think I can handle right now anyway. So, but probably some point in the middle, I will have some of my leftover salad from yesterday. But I did have a granola bar at least, because I was like, I can't, I was like, I can't eat, like, a whole thing right now. So, I'm like, let me just do a little bit at least. You named the runt funfetti? Perfect. Perfect. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. <laughs> I know! Right off the bat, I said, hi guys, and someone immediately said, boring! And I said, how dare? <laughs> how dare? Oh my god, hey! Gothark Fairy, hello Miss Peyton! <gasps> I saw you DM'd me on Discord! I saw you DM'd me this morning, and I was not even checking my Discord notifications. Did not even. Um, but you are amazing, we love you, and was so happy that we got to raid you last night, my friend. Go check out Gothrock Fairy if you guys have not already, they have a great channel. Getting so close to 900 subscribers, by the way. By the way. Amazing. I have an ad for mom's plushie, but like real. <gasps> what? What do you mean? Like mom's plushie, but real? I want it. At 1 a.m. last night, I took my dog outside to potty and she ran into the bushes <gasps> to try and tossle a possum. <gasps> oh my God, that's crazy. Oh my God, AJ, hey, welcome in, welcome in. Have you lurking, no worries. Yes, I was saying thank you so much. Oh my God, yes. I love that for you. I love that for you. So close to 900 subs. Go check Gothrock Fairy out if you haven't already. I know the command is just goth rock, goth rock. You made it easy. You should just make it goth. Um, oh, thank you for saying I look stunning. I appreciate that. I did change my outfit five times. <laughs> so thank you. Strong! Hey! Oh my god, this is live. I thought I was watching a VOD. No, it's happening right now. It's happening as we speak. It's happening in the moment. It's happening in the moment. Right now. Right now. I don't know if I'm gonna change her exterior. Also, Trong, YouTube told me they're gonna give you a refund because they're not um gonna give out those memberships. <laughs> I think I'm keeping her house as is. I think her house is good fine. I think it's fine. Uh, delete self promo. I'm going to post my first vid today. Good luck. Oh, I'm gonna be in the credits for my inspo. Oh my god, so exciting. Thank you so much. That's so cool. Good luck, good luck, good luck. Sending you all the good vibes. Probably going to be getting up um, right now to get a drink because my throat hurts. No, get up. Feel better. Get up, get to drink some tea. <gasps> Trong! Happy birthday, Lexi. <laughs> Happy birthday, Lexi! Well, then go donate it to Lexi. Why are you giving it to me for? Once I get to a computer, we can read your memberships. Oh, you're too kind. You don't have, you do too much. You do too much, Trong. Guys, go check out Trong's channel too if you haven't already. We got lots of awesome creators in here today. Let's do this. Um, all right, let's do that. Do that nice little command. All right, let's get down to business. Blue Bear's house. It's not bad, but it's not good. <laughs> that's, that's, in Trong's eyes, it's everyone's birthday. It's actually my birthday. Did you know it's my birthday? It's mine. Wait, is Dexter in here? Oh. Oh, hold on. Oh, hold on. Um, hold on, hold on. I think Dexter just spit up. Just give me one second, guys. Um.
Okay. Oh, thank you all for the hearts. Gosh, I don't know what's. I we're, he's just. I locked him in here with me, so he's gonna hang out in here now. Um, but he just like had some spit on the floor, and it was like there was like some red in it. So I had to like check to make sure like he's not bleeding or something. And he seems fine. He's acting totally fine. But I don't know what the heck happened. Now I'm like super um worried. Are you okay? He looks totally fine and he was running around out there with like a ball so I think I think he's okay I think maybe when he was outside maybe he just like bit down on his like lip or something and he's like got a little bit of irritation yeah he might have just cut his gum so we're just gonna keep him in here with us with the door shut and just like keep an eye on him uh, so sorry this streams off to a great start are you okay sir are you okay he's looking at me like so I think he's I think he's okay, but thank you all for the hearts for Dexter. I'm I'm sure he appreciates it, and now he is forced to hang out with us. He's got like five different toys in this room, so hopefully, hopefully this is a good environment. So it's okay, Pay. You gotta do what you gotta do. Today's one of those days, I guess. Today's one of those days. Peyton's just like doing all the stuff. Oh, okay, good. He's laying down. He's laying down by this. He just wanted attention. He was like, what if I bite down on my lip and just just to get some extra attention? Dexter, I'll give you the attention, baby. I give you the attention. Thank you guys for the hearts, though. I appreciate it. Oh, my God. Never a dull moment. There's never a dull moment. Okay, anyway, Blue Bear's house. <laughs> hey, Ari, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Hey, Annabelle, welcome in. Hope you Hey, Nikki, hey, everyone. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Coming into some chaos, but aren't you always coming into some chaos? Let's be real. Paint hair is so cute. Thank you. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. I appreciate that. I think I might actually keep the, um, I might keep the flooring and the wallpaper that are already here. And I was gonna do a starry night thing in every single one's house. I forgot to do this for Naomi, but that's okay. This is Blue Bear's house. We're doing the actual people on my island's uh, houses, but we're gonna like break it up. So I'm gonna do a little bit of this. I'm gonna do a villager house, finish a villager house, then go to doing something else that we need to do for the island. We need to get our villager photos. We need to finish the beaches. We need to finish some of the exteriors. So that way we don't get a little bored of just doing the same thing. We'll change it up a little bit. I am going to do this windowsill thing in every single one of the houses. <laughs> hope you guys are doing good. Um, guys, go check out Nikki's channel if you haven't already. Nikki, hope you're doing amazing. I do have my next theme in mind. I'm very excited about it. My next theme is going to be called Autofill Island. It's going to be where I autofill all 10 villagers and they pick the theme. And they pick the theme. Are you okay, Dexter? You all right there's a hair tie on the floor and he is like sniffing it he is sniffing it i am i'm gonna decorate all their houses until i get um sick of it that's why we're gonna break it up because i did three of them the, i did three of them last week and i got sick of it so uh, we're going to do as many as we can and then you know yes autofill island it's coming up Sorry, I'm just, like, very paranoid about my dog, so I just keep looking at him. Yes, this is my dog. I'm not going to pick him up because he did just, like, spit up, and I'm, I've am i locked him in here to kind of keep an eye on him. But uh, if, if I start to notice, he's, he's straight vibing. Wait, look at this dog. <laughs> look at him. <laughs> he's just like, we're vibing. We're vibing. Look at him. Are you a good boy? He's got, um, oh, you can't see it. His favorite toy is this, this cactus. Um, and then that, he likes tennis balls, so he's got a bunch of tennis balls. Isn't he such a cutie? Are you okay? You got, you gave me quite a scare, sir. You gave me quite a scare, m little monkey man. We call him a monkey because he looks like, doesn't he look like he could just swing from the vines? Doesn't he look like he could just swing from the vines? He's a monkey, he's a raccoon, he's a woodland creature. How much does he weigh? He actually just lost some weight because he was eating the food they recommended that we've always been giving him was like really high in fat. So he weighs now 20 pounds, which is good because he's a toy mini. 
he looks like more because he's all hair, but he should be getting his hair cut soon. <laughs> little, isn't he a little baboon boy? He really is. He's like a little monkey, a little woodland creature. I don't know. He's some little monster man that we just found and we love him so much. Emily, hey, what's up? How are you? Peyton, I made it. Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. He is literally half hair. If I put him in the bath, he looks like a little rat man. We like him with the long hair, and the Aussies are supposed to have long hair, um, but it's too hot now, so we gotta get him, you know. Oh yeah, while I was on BRB, my dog was being a drama, a drama king, and I had to make sure he was okay. <laughs> had to make sure he was okay. Hope everything is okay. Finally off and free. Nice. That's the way to do it. That's the way to do it. Actually, I think I want... No, uh, not that. Blue Bear is very this to me. Blue Bear is just very this to me, you know? He kind of looks like my little angel. He's hairy too. Ooh, hydrate. I can and I will. Also, how do we feel about the alerts being in the corner? Um... I never moved them back after Sabotage League last week. Drinking, um, it is a vanilla biscotti flavored coffee today. I can't believe the island's like done. I know what? No, me either. Me either. I can't believe it. I kind of love them in the corner. Yeah. I like them in the corner too. At first I thought it was going to be a temporary thing, but it's kind of nice because as much as I love it popping up on the screen, like a little bit more sleek because I've got all of this stuff on this side of the screen so it's kind of nice to have something in that side of the screen I know that's what a lot of the the professional youtubers do it's a lot of what the professional people do speaking of professional people let me do my little YouTube spiel we got 53 people and 31 likes that's good but not good enough we hit 100 likes I'll tell you a spicy story this is our new thing I guess that we've started I think this was Ronnie who first was like, if we had 100 likes, will you tell us an embarrassing or spicy story? So, we told lots of fun stories yesterday. We hit 100 likes, I'll tell you a fun story. I'll tell you a spicy or an embarrassing story. You alright, buddy? You okay? I didn't know he moved to be like right behind me. Are you okay? Okay. You look okay. You reviving? Sure, you're not spitting anything else. Okay, Peyton, stress today. Hi, Crystal. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing good. This island is not only yours; it's ours. And thank you, Peyton, for giving us this opportunity and seeing it come to an end. I'm so sad and so happy too. Oh, thank you, <gasps> Aqua. Aqua. I thought you moved on from my channel. I thought I'd never see you again, Aqua. How are you? I hope you've been so well. What is up? Aqua is one of our OG viewers. So everyone set, send some love to Aqua. Pretty please. You are the best. Oh, thank you. That's so, guys, that's so nice. All the peeps joining today. Yeah, we've gotten a lot of, um, I've been seeing more and more of some of our original friends come back, which is so nice, which is so, so nice. And uh, it really warms my heart. So thank you for being here. Thank you for being here. And uh, love you too. Thank you guys, thank you. I am a little stressed today, so I appreciate it. I was already a little bit stressed, and now you guys, you guys probably understand. If, you're, if your pets are like not feeling 100%, you're instantly like, oh. crazy. That's how I feel. But all looks good. I think we are gonna do a kitchenette for this one. This bed area, I need IRL, is cute, right? It's cute. I haven't been putting kitchens in all of them. I feel like, oh, you know what? Would she have a kitchen or I think she, I want to have like a music area for her. I kind of want to have like a music area. Because she's like a pop star. Do you know what I mean? She's like a little pop star lady. I've had no time to watch anything after five years. <gasps> no! No! After five years, your landlord gave you 30 days notice to move out. Oh my God, I'm so sorry to hear about that. That that does sound crazy. My boyfriend and I were so worried about that. They gave us one day to be like, oh, by the way, your rent is increasing $200. It starts tomorrow. 
And we were like, I get, okay, I guess that's fine. We we're like, I guess that's fine. I, you know, we thought they were gonna, in New York especially right now, they're raising people's rents like thousands of dollars. So we were a lot worried that it was gonna be worse. I'm so sorry to hear that, but I hope everything is situated now, Aqua. Let's send some love to you. Let's send some love to you. Sending all the love to you, my friend. Gosh, that's the worst. That's horrible. That's so horrible. I can't believe people are like getting away with doing that. Like, it's insane. It's insane. Especially if you've lived there for so long. Like, oh my goodness. Can't imagine. Actually, maybe I do want this to be a kitchen. Maybe this will be a kitchen and then in front of here we'll do like a sitting area and then like a, a sitting area slash um, music. Yes, look at all those hearts. Look at all those hearts. Or should Sky be the one with... I don't know what I'm gonna do for Sky's house. They're all little cute blue people, so I'm like, they all feel very similar to me. How can I make them individual? You know? I wanna make them individuals. Sky will probably do more like clothing and like accessories and stuff. I know. I don't understand America either. Don't understand? Yes, Sloth Queen. Yes, that's me. Me and you're all my sloths. You're all my sloths. We love it. We love it, we love it, we love it. Do, 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 do. It's awful about your rent race. I'm so sorry. We're in our new place. Boxes everywhere. We'll take a bit to get organized, but doing better now. Late Last push to clean out our old place tonight. Oh, I'm sending you all the good vibes. Yeah, listen, I'm just, I'm counting my blessing, blessings. It could have been worse. They're renovating, like, the apartment next door, like, to be brand new. So we were worried that they were going to be like, all right, you guys are out. We're renovating your apartment. Goodbye. But luckily that didn't happen, so we're here for... We're here for now. My brother also loves sloths. I have a sloth plushie I sleep with. I have so many. I actually want to, um, my boyfriend and I always go on vacation and we do like a bunch of arcades. He wins like all of the claw machine games. I solely want to go this year to just get like sloth squishmallows. Not cause I, not cause I want to go on vacation, but because I want the sloth squishmallows. If you were the refrigerator, where would you be? Hello? If you were a fridger, like a ref where is the real refrigerator? Like the one I actually want. Oh, it's down here. Okay, great. Mm. I have had noodles. Had several kinds. I wish it was with the other um, stuff. Already 10 times better than what Blue Bear had. I agree. I agree. Blue Bear needed a makeover. She needed a little makeover, you know. She needed something cute. Hello, Poland. Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Hi, 4DR. Four, uh, four Is it 4Doctor or 4DR? Waffles. Welcome in. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing amazing. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? I think I want this to be mostly... Because everything in here is like kind of light. I guess... Maybe not. I like the idea of the system kitchen, except I feel like it's ugly. Yes, for Dr. Waffles. Oh, that's so cute. I love that. I love that. You don't live in Poland, though. That's okay. It's all right. Ranch furniture has been my new favorite furniture set. It's really cute. I mean, I like this quilted furniture set, too. It's really nice. I wish they had some more colors of it, though. I feel like they could have done a couple more colors, but, you know, maybe I shouldn't be so picky. Should be just happy with what we got. Happy with what we got. It's okay. Um, I got a fridge I want, I think, to do. Where are the, like, tension pole things? Your school's reopening in nine days. Are we excited about this, or are we not excited about this? Is this a good thing or a bad thing? Are we pumped or are we, we not pumped? I love these, but sometimes I hate how far the shelf comes out. All right, we'll put you here. You can go there. Obsessed with the white rattan. I love the white rattan too. That stuff is so good. I guess that's fine. 
Oh, because this is a partition wall. I'm like, why is this not even? Exciting me, friends, but I hate the, the homework, so 50-50. Makes sense. Ooh, campsite visitor. Tell us who it is. Tell us who it is. Hopefully it's someone cute. Hopefully it's someone cute. Um, I am going to do this business. She's got marshmallows just for fun. Or maybe you go up here. You go up here. No, I hate that. Just kidding. <laughs> this is so cute. Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Trying to make it cute. Trying my best. Make it somewhat cute. Make it somewhat cute, but not also not spend the entire day on one build. Looks so cute. I miss watching your builds. Can't wait to see your island. Oh, get ready. It's almost done. It's almost done. I'm excited. Um, uh, da, 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 da. You got Hazel. How do you feel about Hazel? I think people are pretty mixed about her in general. So good interior decorate, decorating. You need to play Sims for decorating. I, I feel like I would like it. I've never played it, but I feel like I probably would like it. Giving me some serious HHP inspo. Oh, thank you. Thanks. I know, Kato loves Hazel. Kato loves Hazel and Sprocket. You lolly in boxes. I have lolly on my island. She's, oh, we already did her house. Hers has been my favorite so far that I've done. I looked back at them the other day and I was like, oh yeah, this one was good. Um, hi Crimson Rose, hope you're doing great. What's up, what's up, welcome in, welcome in. Oh my gosh, Peyton, hi, tomorrow's my last day of college. I miss so many streams recently. No worries, they're always here to watch back and thanks for being here. So much love. That's Crimson Rose. We also have you're linking Crimson. Different people. Same similar name, different people, but that's okay. I am an introvert. I am only an extrovert here in this context. Here and in this context is the only time. Otherwise, I am introvert girl what girl what do you mean girl girl no what do you mean what 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 do you mean i don't know what you mean girl no what i'm sorry ignore me no it's okay <laughs> it's okay you're good i'm such an introvert me too me too me too me too same though, I'm such an introvert, but when I'm around close friends, I'm extroverted. Very that. Hi, Service Paws, welcome in. Hope you're doing great. Hope you're doing amazing. How are you? How are you? Hope all is well. Hope all is well. We got 50 people in here, only 42 likes. I heard a rumor. I heard a rumor. If you click the like button, the number goes up by one. The same thing happens if you click the subscribe button the subscriber number goes up is that nuts hey laser sharp welcome in hope you're doing good hope you're doing good oh 50 like hype thank you guys so much thank you so so much i appreciate it i know i stole that from pat pat said that in his stream the other night i just thought it was so funny the more you know i'm an introvert i love spending time on my own playing games netflix and reading for sure. I never knew that. No, story time at 100. We're shooting big today. Maybe because I didn't have any stories prepared. Because I don't have any stories prepared. But I will. Pat is so smart. I'm like, that's genius. This is Blue Bear's house. We're doing all the stuff we have left to do on my island, um, including the villager interiors. So we're doing villager interiors, then we're going to do something else and then come back to this. Yeah, the more you know. All right, our pop star, Blue Bear. Our pop star. She's got to have her stuff. Hi, Pat. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. What's up? What's up? Hope all is well with you. Hope all is very well. Enjoy hanging out with small groups of people for a couple hours at a time, but then the next day I'm exhausted and get anxiety when I even see a person when I walk my dogs. Yeah. Sounds like you are an introvert then. Sounds like it to me. First thing I do on any streamer video is 
boop that like button because it's the right thing to do. Sometimes I forget. Listen, I won't deny. I, I have forgotten sometimes. Sometimes you forget, but that's okay. Because then you just go ahead and click it. I just did the electric bass, right? Bass, whatever it's called. I called it a bass, not me calling it a bass. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave. Oh, that one's the best one. That one's the best one. Yeah. That's really cute. That's really cute. And I want to put... I feel like I do the cushions in every single one. I don't care. I don't really care. I don't really care. I like the cushions. I like the cushions. I think they're nice. Cushions in the corner, and then it's like you put like a cushion or two just like around. Easy. This is a whole vibe. Thank you. I want to try and make them all different. Make them all different, but like still vary the person that it's there. Hey there, Peyton. It's my first time seeing your stream. Hi, Starlight. It's so nice to meet you. My name is Peyton. Oh, I'm sorry, Dexter. I didn't know you were sitting that close to me. I'm sorry. Um, hi, nice to meet you. I'm working on a Starry Night Island. We're just so close to being done with it. Right now we're doing Blue Bear's interior because we're doing some of the interiors of my villagers and uh, we're having a good time. Welcome in. Thanks for being a, thanks for being a sloth. Thanks for being a sloth. Um, look at him lurking in the back. Look at him lurking back there. He is straight up vibing. Dex, are you lurking? Look at him, he's approaching. Are you okay? Are you okay, little man? Are you okay, little man? <laughs> Started my new island at the same time as your statues. Is this one? Just finished mine today, apart from the beaches. Ooh, exciting, exciting, exciting. This one, I feel like it, if I didn't terraform, if I didn't terraform the island into Starry Night, then I would have finished it so much sooner. It took me so much longer than I thought to terraform the map. I was like, this is gonna take me no time at all. And everyone was like, yes it is, Peyton. And I was like, no it's not. I could terraform the entire map into Starry Night in one stream. Could not. In fact, I couldn't. In fact, I wasn't able to. <laughs> but it's okay. But it's okay. It's okay. Um, what are their, like, s music stuff? Music stuff is what I want. I don't know if she needs, like, a microphone. What? <laughs> I go like this. <laughs> that flip. Oh, I meant the same time as you started yours. <laughs> no worries. I feel like that's what I figured, but I was like, my brain isn't working. Starry Night is one of your favorites as well. I love that. Love that. Same. It's so good. It's just so good. I also do love looking at the stars. That's the worst part about living in this city. I never see them. Never see them, but I remember what they look like. <laughs> I remember what they look like, so. Ooh, actually, I think I want... Uh, I think I know exactly what I want. The bear toys, they're, they're my little um, distinguished workers that I have work at all of the um, builds. All of the stores. Oh my gosh. Let's not curse in my chat. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Make sure, I know autocorrect happens guys, but read your messages before you send them please. Just so we don't have like very bad curse words in my chat. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I also live in the city, but whenever my family and I go to a cabin in the mountains, it's so beautiful to look up at them. Oh my god. That's awesome. That's awesome. That's awesome. Oh, I want to go on a trip. I want to go see the, the things. Oh, look at Dexter. Are you cozy back there? Are you cozy back there? He's vibing back there. This is like her scrapbook, but she's writing her music in it. She's like writing her music in it. Increase my voice. People were saying this yesterday. I have not changed my microphone volume at all. Can you guys not hear me? Because I have it up all the way. 
I have it up all the way. I love how you try your best to make your streams family friendly. <laughs> That's my seven year old. Uh, except for, uh, <laughs> except for when I accidentally said the F word on autofill, not autofill, on Sabotage League last week. <laughs> it was quick. You didn't even hear it. You can hear me. Yeah, I would recommend maybe just checking your volume on the stream. Just check your volume. Maybe because, can you hear the fan a lot? Because the fan is like on the other corner. Oh yeah. I have it clipped. Actually, Ray Ray clipped it. Ray Ray clipped when it happened. It was quick. It was quick. I did catch myself. I said half of it. I was very passionate. I was saying that, um... I was uh, saying, Pat, you're not on my team anymore. And then I said, what the fudge? But it wasn't fudge. It was something else. <laughs> I want this cake in here somewhere, but like, I don't know where. Can the dish rack go on top? No. It kind of can't. We're going to do this. I am going to put this here. No, I can hear it, but it's just, oh, okay. That was fun. <laughs> that was so fun. But it wasn't fudge. Okay, but it wasn't fudge. But, like, you know what I mean? But you know what I mean. You know what I mean. Got headphones. Now I can hear you nicely. Awesome. Awesome. Headphones always help. Headphones always help. There is a hair tie on the floor right in front of Dexter, and I'm just like waiting to see if he tries to eat it. Oh no, he's just sleeping. He's just sleeping. He's being a sleeper. Uh, Alex texted me. Sorry, I just had to tell my boyfriend that Dexter wasn't feeling that good. Um, but I think he's okay now. I'm more than halfway through watching the playback of Sabotage League. It's so fun. Yeah, I agree. I agree. <laughs> I agree. I also think it's fun. I also think it's fun. You're so cute for Dexter checking out. Yeah, I love my little, I love my little dog. I just want to make sure he's okay. I want to make sure he's okay. He's a good boy. He's a good little man. Love that boy. He does, brings me so much joy. And I just want to make sure he's okay. Um, do I like this here? Perhaps. No, I like it there. It's okay. Maybe I make it yellow, though. I don't like that the, the shades of everything doesn't perfectly align. He does look like such a cute dog, right? Isn't he a cute boy? My mom was not watching Sabotage League when it happened. Um, I did tell her about it. She knows that I'm, like, on a competition. But she was not watching it live. She's a busy lady. She's a busy lady. So whenever she's here, we, you know, we celebrate her. But, um, I'll tell her when the next round is. And I can't, I'm going to tell her though. I'm like, if you're in my chat, mom, I will not be able to interact with you. I will not be able to interact with you that much. <laughs> Can a villager walk? I don't need her to, oh. I need her to be able to walk through it somewhat. She can't get to that side at all, but that's okay. As long as she can, like you know, exist in this general space, that's fine. For me, that's fine. The guitar side, it's okay. Frogs, dogs, coconuts! <laughs> I really want a dog or a cat, and my dad thinks they're too smelly. Really? I can ass assure you, my dog is not smelly. Sometimes his breath is a little smelly, but like, sometimes everyone's breath is a little smelly. Shouldn't let that stop you. Bag of chips on the floor because she's a messy girl. I was thinking that. Maybe not chips, but maybe like... Maybe I customize it for something else. Maybe. Where is the bag of chips? If you were a bag of chips, where would you be? Um, somewhere here, right? Right here. Maybe like pretzels? Or cookies! Uh, cookies, hello. Easy. You should put the scrapbook on the cushion so it lets, looks less cluttered. I want it to look cluttered. 
I think I want it to be cluttered. I think I like the clutter. I think I'm a clutter queen. I kind of like it. I kind of like it. I don't know what I want to be on the edge of her bed. Clutter core all the time. Me? Clutter core every day. Clutter core every single day. Every day. I don't know what I want to be in this other spot. Oh, maybe like clothes. Looking very suited to Blue Bear. Thank you. Thank you so much. I am the definition of clutter core. Same. Same. Me too. I kind of like that. It's kind of cute. It's kind of cute. Clutter sloth queen. Listen, you know what you're getting yourself into. It's not like I've ever been like, I'm so organized and perfect. You know? Not that. I love the patchwork bed. It's so cute, right? I do too. I do too. The only time my dogs smell is like two months after getting grooming. That's when they come back from going outside. Yeah, I feel like Dexter never really smells. Just his breath. But like, you know, and then you give him a treat or you like brush his teeth and it's fine. I feel like sloths, uh, sloths are not organized. And who cares? They don't need to be. I love this. Wait, this one is the best one so far. I don't know, actually Lolly's was pretty good. How is the president of the sloth squad today? I'm okay. I'm having a little bit of a kooky day so far. But we're we're doing okay. Not me falling asleep while working, then just waking up again. Oh my god. Hey cool, I hope you're doing good today. What is up? What is up? Hope all, all hope all is well. Hope all is well. I hate how low these are. Like, who did this? Why did this happen? The sloth is green. Yes, the sloth is green. The people who joined my sloth squad membership on the very first day it existed had their sloths turn green yesterday. Which is very exciting. The sloth is green. My Frenchie is a lot of gas. <laughs> he's worth it. Well, you know what? As long as he's worth it. And I'm sure he is. Sure he is. I think I want to do this. I think I want it. Mm. Dare we with the gingham? Too much gingham? It's a lot of gingham. It's a lot of gingham. It's too much. Too much gingham. It's okay. I have like glow in the dark window things, but I don't have any in white. Which is annoying. I also did one of these moments. I feel like Blueberry is this kind of girl. Is there a blue one? There's a pastel. There's a dark blue, but it's too dark. I mean, that's kind of cute. It's like kind of cute. I think it's kind of cute. I do have the star garland. I do, but the star garland isn't a ceiling item. It's a wall item. I mean, I guess I could, I guess I could put it on that wall. <gasps> Sienna, respectfully, I'm in love with your hair. Oh my God, stop. Hi, bestie, how are you? Hope you're doing so good. What's up, what's up, what's up? There is this, but like, then you can only put it back here. Oh, I mean, that is kind of cute. Mm -hmm. I am mm, cute. I am, you already are, you guys are already sub to Sienna, but if for some reason, if you're not, what if you did? Well, what if you, what if you did? I think your life would be changed. I think it would be. Sienna has not found Bunny yet, but, um, you know who saw a bunny? In the final round of Sabotage League, not mine, I didn't find Bunny. Was it? I think it was Olive who found Bunny, like, in a couple tickets, and I, like, screamed. I was like, oh my god, no. <laughs> Not Bunny. The, the the yellow ones, too? You think the yellow ones? I was feeling the blue. I could, because she's Blue Bear. I could check the yellow ones. Check the yellow. Check the yellow ones. You're kidding. I know. I was like, oh. I said, I'm like, if I get Bunny, I should get, like, a million bonus points. I like the 
blue better anyway. BRB means be right back. Be right back. Cute. I kind of like the fan too over there. Then we're going to give her some lights and then we're going to Here's what we're going to do. We're going to take a we're not going to go right into the next house. We're going to do a little beach detour. Try and get some villager pictures and then come back and do more houses. Just so I don't get sick of them. Because I got really over them really fast in the last stream. We have to finish them. But I need to like do a bunch of other stuff too to finish the island. Um, geez, Sienna, that's in I can't believe. I think that she was just permanently erased from Sienna's game. Like just permanently. Hey, just got on. Good morning. It looks great. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yeah, she's just literally like erased. I'll be in lurk mode all getting ready, but just want to say, hey, all the good vibes to you. Ooh, love you, bestie. Thanks for the lurk. Thanks for the lurk. Sending you bunny vibes. <laughs> Sending you bunny vibes always. This house looks so good. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. It's been cute. It's, it's looking cute so far. I'm okay with it. I don't hate it. I don't hate it so far. You found Bunny last night on your seventh ticket. Almost took her simply because of Sienna and PJ Llama looking for her, but took Walker! My favorite, and Walker is one of the, um, because Walker has his birthday in June, so he's one of the icons you can get. I need to make sure I get him, because I love that boy. He's my favorite. He's my favorite little man, and I love him. That's really high up. I mean, that's pretty high up. That's pretty high up. Bye, chat. Bye, Peyton. I gotta go, of course. If I have time, I'll be back. No worries. No worries. No worries. Wow, this looks amazing. Thank you so much, Mr. Nate. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. If you have any rabbits amiibo, you can put them in your campsite while you, to improve your chances. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Actually, I think I... I don't know about the bottles. Let's do this one. Let's do this one. Amazing. And then, I feel like you can never go wrong with, like, these things. These things always look good. Always look good. They always look good, in my opinion. I know, I can't believe it. Nearly at 3K. I think we're almost at, um, I didn't check today yet. I think we're getting close to 2 yeah, we're getting kind of close to two, 27. Getting kind of close. We're at 2665. So we're getting kind of close to 2700. Which is a lot of people. And I can't believe that at all. At all. Can't believe it. How did that happen? Craziness. Cuckooness. But thank you guys. I appreciate Thank you for being here. Thanks for hanging out. We had 60 likes too. Thank you guys for the 60 likes. If you haven't already liked the stream, you could. You could. Hi, Awful Gaming. Welcome in. How are you? I hope you're doing so good. Go straight. Joke. Go, la, 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 la. go check out Awful Gaming's channel if you have not already. Go and do that. What if you did that? Wouldn't that be cool? I think so. I think so. I know so. I think, actually, maybe let me keep the old clock she had. Great, hope you're well. Good, yeah, I'm doing good. We're doing good. We're gonna finish the island. I'm excited. I'm excited, excited, excited. Perhaps we do more of these. Perhaps we do more. All right, I'm trying to finish this one. And... Hey, Ann, what are we decorating today? Everything that's left on the island. Everything left. Hope you're doing good, Clementine. So we're doing villager houses. We have to finish up the beaches. Other things. This is Blue Bear's house. This is Blue Bear. I think I want, um, where's the light switch? Light switch? Am I stupid? It's this one. Ha ha ha. My next island theme is going to be Autofill Island, where I autofill all ten villagers. And I let them pick the theme. And I let them pick the theme. 
Actually, I kind of hate that. Kind of don't like that. So that's gonna be fun. Excited for that. I'm excited for that. Gang them. Gang them. When in doubt, gang them. How do you make wall decor? How do you make a wall decor only on one wall? What do you mean? What do you mean? Like this? Like this thing? Like do the accent wall? Is that what you mean? Um, cute. I think I'm done. I think I'm done. Accent wall? Um, you you have to get it through Happy Home Paradise, but you click X. And then I put like a partition wall in front of it. Yeah, like an accent wall. Yeah, when you're going through the things, you just click X on the one you want to do the accent wall. And this is the room. Oh, I'm not restarting it. I'm flattening. I'm flattening. We're flatten. Flatten queen. All right, this is Blue Bear's house. I think it looks cute. And great. And amazing. She can't move in it, really, but that's okay. <laughs> Hello, my friend. Welcome in. How do I say your name? It's Inga? Inda? Is that how I say? I always want to say. I always say everyone's names right. The cranny with the stars is amazing. Ah, oh, thank you. How did I change the size of the room? I didn't. Did not change the size of the room. This is the size of the room it came in. Yep, I got it. Yay. As I hate when people say my name wrong. So you don't want to change the exterior. Don't want to change the exterior. Exterior was good. All right. Let's take a detour and let us do a round of gifting all the villagers to try and get their pictures and then let's go work on the beaches then we'll do another house then we'll do another house cool can't wait to see the flattening oh my god i'm gonna flatten everything except for the star fragments i'll leave every star fragment where it is and then just open my gates and everyone can have the star fragments because i can't like what am i gonna do with all the star fragments like it's it's too many it's too many for me where did we end this? We ended this last night over here. We ended this on this beach is what we were doing. Hi, Dirk Fox. You just got Happy Home Paradise. Nice. I love Happy Home Paradise so much. So much. It's very fun. Is this song loud? Because I can hear it playing through my headphones. It's also not on the same playlist. I don't know why. Please only play this playlist. Because <laughs> what happens is like I'll put on a um, royalty free playlist and then it'll finish the playlist and then it'll give me other songs that aren't royalty free. I'm like, no. Stop that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. I really love it. I have a lot of fun with it. Personally. I really like it. I have all of those confetti machines too to use. Hey Starry, hope you're doing good. I accidentally clicked unsub. Well, you could click that cute little subscribe button and fix it. What if you did that? That'd be kind of cool. I think that'd be kind of cool. I don't know, maybe that's just my opinion. Looks bigger than the other houses. I Yeah, it's just the same size. Maybe my innovative design made it look bigger. <laughs> Don't worry, I did. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Appreciate that. All right. Let us also get... I have another gazebo. I might do that. No worries. Enjoy, enjoy your lurk. Or welcome back from your lurk, rather. I think I want another gazebo. Also, maybe these guys? Maybe some of these? Okay, well, we'll start with all this then. We'll start with all this then. Um, and I have my ducks too! I love the ducks. I love the ducks so much. So much. Oh, and I wanted to put maybe... I didn't get more butterflies. I was gonna put more butterflies over here. Not happening, because I didn't get them. Did not get them. Um, 
I love the duckies. Me too. They are so cute. They're pretty cute. Watching a horror movie, it's called Forever Purge. It's literally my favorite movie right now. I've never heard of it, but I'm glad you love it. Glad you love it. Sounds good. Had Animal Crossing since April 2020, and I just finished my last home loan. Oh my god, congrats. That's awesome. That's awesome. Congrats, 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 my friend. Oh, I didn't get a custom room share. I need one. I need one. I need one. Well, I got my basement. Have to pay off two mil. Oh my goodness, we're sending you good vibes. Sending you good vibes. It's so much money. They make it so hard. Especially if you don't like spicy island. I spicied all that money. I'm a fraud. I'm a fraud. It's okay. It's alright. Actually, I think I do want a gazebo. If not for this beach, then for the other one. I know I got a gazebo yesterday. I got two, because I used one of them. But one of them I know I didn't use. I'm broke, I have 30,000. I have a lot, but it's not, I didn't acquire it on my own. So does it even count? Huh? Does it even count? Huh? You know? I don't think I would like how this looks here, but let's find out. I might. Maybe? Wait, where is it? Am I stupid? Wait, um. Did I just not grab it? Sell fossils and seashells to get that money. Do it. I also always like diving. I felt like diving was, I did grab it. Where did it go? I always feel like diving was an easy way for me to make money. I feel like it was easier than, um, oh, it was right there. Okay. Yeah, I got max spells from Spicy Island too. But yeah, sell your fruit too. It's a good option. That's also a good option for sure. A spicy island is a treasure island that is when people uh, hack their switch and they get it so that they have all of the items and you can just get them. Hey Greta, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing good. What's up? I have so much to do, like water my flowers and stuff, but every two days I get 96,000 from your farm stuff. Okay, you're making money. You're doing it. You're making those bells. You're making those bells. You're doing it. I recommend watching YouTube videos on it. That's what I did. I recommend watching Little Branches Crossing videos on them. Because they're really good. Because they're really good. Gazebo? Okay. No gazebo for me. Fine. What about if I put it here? Do I like the gazebo here or? Mm. I might like it over here better. Let's find out. I'm on them now, not played in a while, need to stock up. Sometimes you just gotta get a bunch of stuff. I kinda like that better, that's better. That's better. I gotta put something here though, then. I don't know what. Another crescent moon chair? Maybe. Why not? No, I need more balloons. Where are my balloons? Did I use all my balloons? I need more balloons. I need some more balloons. I know I don't have any more of the best of all balloons. I have one, but it's the wrong color. Will I go to the alpaca just to customize that one? Maybe. But the glowing moss ones, I don't think I have, and I do not have the DIY recipe for it. So, a big yikes. Oh, I could put these on the beach too. Cause I use these quite a bit on the island as well. Okay, great. I think balloons go, that's, that's about it though. No, I've got a couple. Okay, I have a couple. Let me put this down. And then we'll come back to it put this here great iconic amazing 
beautiful. Sometimes lights are just pretty. Calculations wrong on every other day. Well, it's still a lot. Doing cottage core is so difficult. To there are so many good options though. You gotta have maple. You gotta have um me. So easy then proce proceeds to name one villager. You gotta have maple, you gotta have Molly, you gotta have like a, a squirrel, one of the cute squirrels. You gotta have like Silvana or Poppy. Same doing cottage core too. It's cute. It's cute. You gotta have like all the cute ones. <laughs> all the cute ones, you know? The cute ones, guys. I spent 30 minutes scrubbing dried cheese off my pan. No, that's gonna be a no from me. That sounds not fun. The ones I'm definitely have is Molly, Maple, Punchy, and Fa Oh, yeah, Fauna! I love Fauna. She's such a cutie. Apparently, there are new customization options from Cyrus. Um, you can make up your furniture. Yes, of your furniture rusted. Yes, there are also, like, damaged ones. There's, like, damaged, damaged customizations that are really cool, too. That I like. I think it's cool. I love these balloons. The balloons are just nice. The balloons are just nice. Dexter is out cold back there. Can you guys see him in the background? He is like out cold back there. He said he chose sleep. Dexter chose sleep today. Have to go now, bye. No worries, Mr. Nate. Thanks for hanging out. Much love. Have a great rest of your day slash night. All the love. And all the love. Got to charge my phone. Be back soon. No worries, my friend. No worries. No worries. No worries. Dexter's my spirit animal. Literally look at him. He's just... Straight vibing. Me too. Dexter, me too. He is just... It's a little pause. He's just... A sleepy baby. A sleepy baby back there. That's my sleepy baby boy. I know, isn't he so cute? He has no business being that cute. I would sleep on the floor if I could. Same. I was always the person when I lived back at home, I would always just like lay on my floor. Not here so much. Not here so much in my apartment. <laughs> Cause we bring the outside in more, I feel like. I don't like it, but. I used to always, like, lay on my floor when I had a carpet. What's a carpet? What is a carpet even like anymore? I don't even remember. Okay. I love all of the confetti. Shout out to Koi for the confetti. <laughs> Shout out to Koi for the confetti. It's just fun. The confetti is just fun. Like, look at that confetti. Like, oh, it's just such a good item so good i can't sleep on most situations but these days the issue is staying asleep yeah alex was talking so much in his sleep the other night and so alex will like talk about work things in his sleep and the other night he was talking in his sleep and i was like alex you're you're talking in your sleep <laughs> like lol hun you're right and he was like, oh, that's so funny. I haven't talked to my sleep in a while. And I was like, yeah, you haven't. Then this next night, he's talking so much. He's literally saying a paragraph. And I was like, Alex, shut up. <laughs> and I woke him up. I was like, Alex, shut up, dude. And um, then the next night, he was laughing in his sleep. And I was like, Alex, what are you doing? And then when he woke up in the morning, he was like, why did you just start talking to me in the middle of the night? And I'm like, because you were laughing at yourself, you psychopath. And he was like, oh my God, was I? And he had zero recollection. Like, I, that's what we said. I was like, he was like, I, he's like, we need to start recording them. He's like, what am I even talking about? I'm like, I don't know. I don't know. Nonsense that I don't understand. You're saying, like, he's saying all, like, tech stuff. I'm like, I don't know. I don't know, dude. Something. Welcome, Drippy. Welcome in, welcome in. Congrats on what? <gasps> what? What did I do? He's, but he's like, 
<laughs> he was literally like, why are, Why did you start talking to me in the middle of like us sleeping last night? I'm like, no, I was telling you to shut up, dude. I was telling you to shut up so I could go to sleep. <laughs> and he was like, oh. And I was like, yeah, hun. Crazy person. As a kid, I would lay down on blankets, sleep on the floor for weeks on end. I, there's something nice about the floor. There's something nice about the floor. When it's like a comfy carpet, then yeah. If it's like a bad hardwood, no. But there's something about like a nice carpet, your childhood bedroom. I wanna sleep on the floor. Listen, Dexter sleeps on the floor. Dexter has a nice cozy bed and yet he still chooses to sleep on the floor. Pulling a Gulliver for sure. For sure. For sure. Absolutely. When I talk in my sleep, I usually talk in Tagalong, Filipino language. So my boyfriend can't even tell what you're saying. I love that. Could be talking smack and he wouldn't know. Gotta have head off now, lunchtime for me. Can you bring me some lunch? Can I have some? I'll take some lunch. Thanks. Bye, my friend. Have a great rest of your day slash night. Um, oh, it was hardwood. Yikes. So did you like that though? I feel like that's that would be so uncomfortable though, wouldn't it? Oh, I think I gotta get the Zen cushions that I bought from my thing. You slept in a tent in your childhood bedroom? Oh my god, I want a tent. What the heck are you thinking about, sir? There's nothing for you to think about. Your life is wonderful on this island. Ungrateful little bunny. What do you mean, Doc? How dare, I give you so many presents. I'm just waiting for you to give me your photo. How dare you? Literally, how dare. I was a strange child. <laughs> Weren't we all? Weren't we all? We had a Thomas a Trank engine, oh my god. Wait, tent, oh it was a tent? I love Thomas the, whatever, tank, trank. Did I say trank, tank? No, I'm not gonna hit him with a net, I love him. Peyton, this island's so beautiful. I love it so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I think I had like a, um, no, I had a Dora sleeping bag, not a tent. I thought I had a tent for some reason. I didn't. <gasps> He's awoken from his slumber. He's awoken from his slumber. Did you have a nice nap? Did you have a good nap? He had a good nap, I think. Look at him. Do you have a good nap? Was that good? Yeah. He's looking at me like I'm nuts. He's looking at me like I'm nuts. Good morning, Dexter. You woke up, you came back. He's looking at me like I'm insane. He's like, he's like, hello, miss. He was like, hello, miss, what do you want? <laughs> good morning, Christian. Yes, he's so adorable. What are you doing? He's vibing back there, sleeping. He's like, why did you lock me in this room with you, miss? <gasps> he approaches. Hi. Hello, baby. Hello, baby. Are you okay? You feeling okay? Are you feeling okay? He's just going. You feeling all right? Hold on. Dexter. You say hello to everybody? You say hello. <laughs> this is Dexter's stream. It's not, it's not my stream. It's your stream. It's Dexter's stream. It's not my stream. This is Dexter's corner. This is Dexter's corner. We're just here. You're just standing there. Look at him. What are you looking at? What are you looking at, sir? You all right? <laughs> Dexter really is the star. He really is. Aw, he's, oh, he's stretching. You doing your stretches? Hi. You doing your stretches? He's a good boy. He's like, whatever, Peyton. He's like, okay, hun. He's like, I'm up for my nap now. Why have you locked me in this room with you? Cause you 
threw up before, hon. Aw, oh, now he's laying right next to- Oh, can you guys see him? Wait. Oh, you can't see him. He's, like, literally right under my chair. Um. Because you were sick this morning, Dexter. I gotta keep an eye on you, puppy. Pretty much what happens is my cat decides to snuggle while I'm streaming. Dexter never wants to. Dexter is like... Mm-mm. Yes, almost 70 likes, one like away. Do you guys know if you click the like button, the number goes up by one? Did you know that? That's kind of crazy. Isn't that kind of crazy? Did I put away the DIY bench? Or did I have it somewhere? Oh, thank you for 70 likes. Thank you so much. All the hype, all the hype to you guys. All the hype in the world. Thank you guys so, so much. Oh, my coffee's like leaking on me. It does also give you a little bit of confetti. And I like the confetti. <gasps> no, don't click it twice. You can click it three times if you're so inclined. The next island, for example, if you were to get Boone as an autofill, what ideas come to mind? Here's the thing with me. I can't just do cottage core, jungle core, fairy core, kid core, farm core. They're great. I can't do it. I gotta spice it up. So it would have to depend on who his co-people are. He gives me very jungle vibes. But it would have to be something spicy. Like jungle on fire. <laughs> jungle on fire. <laughs> That's what it would be. Jungle on fire. I'm just trying to do arson core pretty much, guys. Arson core, stardew core. I don't think I could do stardew core because I'm still so new to the game. But that'd be cool. Arson core! I love it. I love all the fire stuff. If I get Phoebe, we're doing arson core. <laughs> and we're doing it. When I stayed at my grandma's while my, with my siblings, my youngest brother started calling my name. And I just kept saying, what? And he was still asleep. I thought he was possessed. Oh my god. That's crazy. Hey, Amy, what's up? I just got here. How are you today? I am okay. How are you? I hope you're doing good. Do I not have any more customization ingots? No. No, I don't. Flora, flamingo. Every, everything is flamingo. If I got moose, then I quit my channel. Okay. De oh, wait. Dexter's doing his walrus move. Hold on. Dexter sleeps like a walrus sometimes. Oh, uh, go lay back down. He was like fully. He was like full walrus. Full walrus over there. All right. Well, I ruined it. I ruined it. Yeah, I was I sick all morning, and then Dexter has been like not feeling good today, so that's why he's like locked in this room. <laughs> feeling a little cuckoo crazy. It's been a little crazy today, but we're doing all right. We're having a good time. He is camera shy. You camera shy. See now he's right back to it. But as soon as I move this chair, as soon as I move this chair, he'll move. It really is the Dexter show. We're not even here for me. We're here for Dexter. <gasps> Hi, Blue Bear. Literally not at all. Hi, Dawn. Welcome in. How are you? How are you? What's up? What's up? What's up? Sending you and Dexter good healing vibes. Thank you. Thank you, my friend. I think he just, like, bit down on his lip or something because he, like, had some, like, drool, but there was, like, blood in it. So I think he's okay. I, like, checked his mouth. Of course, this happened, like, five minutes into the stream. So, I just have him in the same room with me so I could keep an eye on him. But I think he's okay. I checked him out and he seems fine and he's acting normal. But I just get really nervous. And then me, I'm fine. I'm just chronically ill. Wonderful! And you? Better now. Better now. Hopefully things will be less chaotic. I know. <laughs> it's always chaos here. It's always chaos. We like chaos a little bit, but like the good kind. The good kind of chaos. Mm. You know what I mean? The good kind. All right, I don't even remember what these customization kits. Oh, for the cushions. For the cushions is what they're for. Do the plants even work today? I was gonna say, I was like, I haven't even seen them. I haven't seen them. Excuse me, Naomi. I'm so sorry. Naomi, I'm so sorry. You're in my way. 
Do, 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 do. There you go. Like Spike. If you guys haven't already liked the stream, you could. What if you did? What if you did? The number will go up if you do it. And that's pretty nuts. It's pretty cuckoo. It's pretty cuckoo. Oh, I need to open these things. I need to open these things. I see more than 50 likes. No, I said today I'll be spicier and I'll tell one at 100. No spicy story yet. No spicy story yet. But 100 likes, I'll tell you a spicy story. Spicy or embarrassing? I'll have to, I'll have to pick one. I'll have to pick one. Remember when there was a ghost last night, guys? I never figured out what happened with that. It was just being weird. On the other side, I think that they're, are they this on the other side? I think they are. 30 more likes for a spicy story. A spicy story. There are so many stories I wanna tell, but I can't. There's so many stories I wanna tell, but I'm like, it's too spicy. It's too, too spicy. We can't handle the spice. No angel of music today. I think they were hanging something up. They must have been hanging something up. <laughs> I can. I'll tell you. I really want to tell the frog story, but it's too. It's too graphic. I want to tell the frog story, but I think it would be too... Well, we did talk about... <laughs> we did talk about Jeffree Star um, butchering yaks last night, so maybe we can talk about anything. I still can't get over that. I can't believe that. I don't want to go into it too much, because I don't want to talk about how horrible of a person they are. But um, they... In case you missed me talking about this last night, they bought like a ranch in Wyoming and moved and like got a, a bunch of yaks and was like, I'm going to go live this chill life and like hang out with my yaks. And everyone was like, okay, cool. So for the whole year, they've been posting pictures of them like hanging out on a farm with the yaks and everyone's like, oh, nice. They're kind of out of the spotlight now. And they're like taking time to be on a farm with their yaks. And, um, People last year were like, oh, we noticed that you made a trademark for, like, a butcher. And Jeffrey was like, oh, well, I'm just trying to protect my brand because since I own a yak farm, I don't want people to steal my name and use it to do those, her like, bad things. I love my yaks. They're my pets. And then now he is promoting um, yak jerky. And he's like, well... The ones I've posted pictures with are my friends, but the other yaks, yeah. We're butchering them. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. And so last night I showed pictures of yaks. And we all looked at these beautiful yaks. Can you believe that? I'm still appalled. Don't you just want to hug these yaks? Look at them. I'm still not over it. We still have to Aren't yaks so cute? Hey, fans, sorry I'm late. Never any, never late at all. Um, really need someone to make me happy. I hope I can do it. I came in just to see these babies. Who would want to hurt those babies? Who would want to hurt those babies? I need answers. I'm appalled. I was talking about this last night, too. <laughs> That's why they're already on the live image. It's sad. A sad time. I was like, how, how did this happen? Hey, Ronnie, I hope you're doing good. If you're gonna make jerky, at least, yeah, just be like, hey, I'm starting this farm and I am going to be making jerky. Like, I'm really sorry, but that's what I'm gonna do. Don't be like, the yaks are my friends. I'd never hurt the yaks and then proceed to hurt the yaks. You know? Like, how dare? I'm good, how are you? I'm doing good, thanks so much, Ronnie. If you guys aren't already subbed to Ronnie, well, why not? What if you did? Well, what if you, like, did? Oh, you're no longer thinking. Oh, okay. 
Hey, hello from the UK. This is my first time I've caught you live. Welcome in, welcome in. You're coming in. You just missed the cute yak pictures. I'll bring them back. You ever see what a yak looks like? Look how cute the yaks are. I want one. Listen, I can't take care of one. Why are there no yak villagers? Like, I... I just like... They're cute. They're, aren't they so cute? They're so cute. I want to cuddle a yak. I want to cuddle a yak, too. 100%. Let's take a field trip. Let's take a little Peyton's Corner field trip to a yak farm and hang out. With, let's go see. Can we go save the yaks? Yes, I would love a Highland cow villager. That would be adorable. This is why I'm vegetarian. I Listen, I get it. I get it. I want to be. I want to be. I do need to make sure I eat enough, like, red meat, though, because I am severely iron deficient, and I can't take iron pills because they give me stomach aches. But I always have been like, I wish I want to do it, but I don't know if I can. I don't know if I can. But I support I support people who do. Nobody can get tattoos on the field trip. <laughs> you want to try me? I got this tattoo on a field trip. I'll take I'll get another tattoo. Highland cows are really cute too. I mean, you could have Yeah, right? Why not yak? Why not Why not yaks? I want a yak. I want a pet skunk. D uh yes. Of course. Or a pet fox. I want a raccoon. I already have a raccoon. The raccoon is already here. I already have a raccoon. No, don't get up. You lay down. I have my, my little raccoon back there. Zoo vlogs? I would love to. I've never been to any of the zoos in New York. Can you believe that? I've never been to any of them. I want to... You should draw a yak. <laughs> I want a baby sloth, too. I just... Hug a sloth so bad. Guys, imagine, imagine if I got to hug a sloth, I think my life would be complete. If Alex doesn't propose to me with a sloth, I feel like, guys, tell Alex one day whenever he wants to propose to me, tell him that he needs to find a sloth and give the sloth the ring. And then the sloth can present me with the ring. Oh, that's that's what I want. Gabrielle, how are you? What's up? What is up, my friend? I hope you're doing good. If you're not already subbed to Gabrielle, why not? I don't want to put these on here. Yes, I... Okay, so many people sent me that video. So many people sent me that video, and I watched it every time. I did watch it every single time. It's good. It's good. I don't know what else I want to put over here. Oh, I still have, um... Flowers. Hi, Nikki. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Of course. Of course, my friend. Of course. Of course. Okay, after I finish this beach, then we're gonna go do a nice little round of gifting my villagers stuff, and then we'll do another house. Okay? I am back. I was helping my mom. She's kind of sick. Oh, no. Let's get some hearts and some hype from your for your mom. I hope she feels better. <gasps> Hi from Germany! I am German. I've never been to Germany. Hello from Germany. Hi. Welcome in. Nice to meet you. Nice to see you. Order bots are better. I think. I happen to think. 100 likes for a story. Yes. Just like normal. You started this trend on our channel. You started it. We've been doing it. We got some spicy stories yesterday. I want to tell the frog story. But it's graphic. I'll have to, I, I want to tell it, but I think I'll have to, like, it's... I can't tell it. I can't tell it. It's too bad. It's too bad. The frog story is too bad. It's too bad. It's a horrific story. It's a horrific story. It's really sad. It's a really sad story. But it was insane. Um, I have another story, too. I gotta think of something else. 
some of us like horror stories. I might tell it, but you're not allowed. I was like eight years old, so you're not allowed to be mad at me that I was there while this happened. I did not eat the frog. Did not eat the frog. Imagine though. Just tell people to. I'll t I'll give it. I'll give a warning. I because I kind of want to tell that story because it's kind of a crazy story. I told that story at my sweet sixteen, um, because my friend that this story happened with, I dedicated it like a candle to him for my sweet sixteen. And I told the entire place the story, and everyone thought it was the craziest story. So, I'll tell the story. If we hit 100 likes, I'll tell the story. I told you yesterday about how I faked passing out to quit a job once. I mean, and how I got a tattoo on a field trip. So, who knows? Who knows what stories I'm going to tell next? Who knows? Also, where did I put... Oh, I know where I put... I put the villager presence by Lolly's house. Do I have more telescopes? I think I do. I think I got a lot of telescopes. Then again, I've used a lot of telescopes. Yeah. You missed some spicy stories. Yesterday, <laughs> yesterday the stories were extra spicy. They were extra spicy yesterday. Okay. I think this is, oh, I should use these at some somewhere use these somewhere um somewhere i should use those oh you met you missed the tattoo story i think the best story was the um work story but the tattoo one was good the baseball one was pretty humiliating too from yesterday you have toffee flavored K cups and they're so good. I have toffee flavored K cups too. Except the ones I have are buttered toffee. And I'm not gonna lie, it's a little too buttery for me. Those are like the last ones I drink. Like when I get to the end of the variety pack, I'm like, alright, I guess I'll drink these ones now. I feel like just regular toffee would be better. Tattoo one was good, but it was more of an in it was more of an injustice rather than me being spicy. Yeah, I agree. I have some fun uh the funniest story I've ever had, I can't tell it. I could never tell you guys because it's so inappropriate. But I have a crazy story that I wish I could tell you. Maybe I'll tell the mods one day. Maybe I'll tell the mods one day. 18 plus, 18 plus stream, I tell the crazy story. My tattoo says purpose. My tattoo says purpose. Um, but yeah, I have, I have some crazy stories. Um... I love Starbucks toffee nut K cups. I've never had those. That sounds so good. Sounds like a member. No, but a lot of the members are are youngins. I can't tell that story to the youngins. Can't tell that story to the youngins. It's not okay for them. It's not okay. <laughs> uh, but I, I'll tell the frog one though. The frog one is okay. Peyton after dark. Adult Discord. <laughs> when we do that, yeah. Okay, what else do I have? I'll put the ducks. <gasps> do you pronounce your name like Peyton too? Or is it Patton? Hi, welcome in. Nice to meet you. Nice to see you. Hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Ducky. A duck. I like the ducks, okay? The ducks are good. The ducks are, like, nice. They're cute. Look at that. Tell me that duck isn't perfect. Tell me you don't want to hang out with that duck. Um, okay. Great. I think we're about done with this beach. So, let's go do some villager photo gifting. And then let's go do another villager interior. I'm getting a spam wrist phone call. Hi, Cammy. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. I love the ducks. They're so cute. Thank you. They're just vibing. This isn't even the pond, like, code. They're just hanging out. Because I have this code, but then I have the, um, Starry Night Water code, which is, like, this one. I have this one, too. Perhaps I should have used this one on the beaches, but I didn't. It's too late for that. It's too late for that. There isn't not a cute name for a baby duck. I agree. 
When did Dexter come over here? Oh my god. Baby dog. Let me put all this stuff away. Let me put all this stuff away. And let's move on. Love your island. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Dawn. I appreciate it. It's a Starry Night inspired island, so I terraformed the map to be like the Starry Night painting. It's almost done. Can't believe it's almost done. How crazy, how cuckoo, how nuts. How nuts. What did I miss? I've done, I'm doing everything that's left to be done on the island today. So we did one villager interior. We did Blue Bear's house. We just did another beach. Now we're gonna try and get some villager photos and then we're gonna do a another interior. Look at Ione, straight vibing. Hi. Hello, Ione. What a cutie. <laughs> yes, I linked Awful Gaming already. We love them. Also, look how cute Lolly's house is. I did Lolly's house the last time I did this. And I decided this one's my favorite. Look at this house. This came out good. This one came out cute. Her house came out good. I like hers. Listen, it's gonna be sim- they're all gonna be a little similar, but it was cute. It's cute. Oh my god, so cute, right? I love that one. That one's my favorite. Naomi's was okay, too. I did Naomi's and Bam's already, too. So now I've done Naomi's, Bam, hi Chai. Um, let me get these presents. I've done Naomi's, Bam, Blue Bear, and Lolly. When am I decorating my own house? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. I can't decide yet if I'm gonna like room sketch everything and then order everything I use or if I'm just gonna, I don't know. I don't know yet. Okay, so I don't, I have villager photos for Ione, Sherb, and Lolly, so I don't need to gift them, I'm gifting everyone else. So Miss Chai, hello Miss Chai. Hello Miss Chai. You want these apples? 80 like hype. Thank you guys so much. Thank you for the likes. If you haven't already, you could like the stream. You could like the stream. Their island is so pretty. I bet you work like 24 hours trying to do it. I mostly have done it all in the um, stream. So there's not very much that I've done um, off the stream. But yeah, it's taken, I mean, it's taken what? How, how much time? Like two months? 20 more likes and Peyton tells her spiciest story. Peyton tells a crazy story. All right, Chai. All right, moving on. Moving on. And we need to still find the other rock. I know one of the rocks is over here, but I do not know where the other rock is for the rock garden. Hey, Peyton, how are you feeling? I found Lolly in a villager hunt and took her after falling in love with her from watching your streams. Oh my god. I love that. I love Lolly. She's such a cute girl. I'm doing good. Hope you're doing good, Ellie. What's up? What's up? Frog story and 18 likes. Who doesn't want to hear the frog story? I mean, it's a pretty we it's a pretty bad story, guys. It's pretty it's a pretty intense story. Alright. This is for you, Sky. Sky, give me your picture. I feel like next it'll probably be Poncho who gives me his picture. It could be Sky. It could be. She might be next. No. I've been doing this a lot off of stream. So I feel like they're all ready. They're all ready to give me their picture, but um I liked Sky passed her up on yesterday's hunt. She is such a cutie. Yeah, she probably wouldn't fit the vibe of your island, but she is a cute lady. She's a cute lady. She's a cute lady. I was playing AC and gifted all my villagers. Oh, and Sterling gave you his picture. Nice. Uh, amazing. Amazing. I think Poncho will be the one to give it to me next. I was surprised when I got Sherbs. Sherbs was the first one we got. Then we got Ione. And then I got Lolly off stream too. So we don't need to gift Sherb because I already have his. So let's see about Poncho and... Doc. My theme is Starry Night inspired island, so it's all blue and yellow, and it's inspired by the Starry Night painting. So it's all stars. 
and the map is terraformed to look like the painting. <gasps> He's cooking! And this is what my map looks like. This is what my map looks like. What's the best thing to get villagers? I found a lot of success with giving them assessed fossils. Now I'm giving them stacks of apples. Because I ran out of fossils to give them. <laughs> what are you making? Mixed fruit bagel sandwich. Yummy. Yummy. Yeah, I ran out of fossils to give them. So I was like, all right, we'll give them some fruit. Yeah, the fruit's easy too. Hi, potato tomato. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing great. All right, Poncho. Give me your picture, bestie. Give me your picture, bestie. Whose house should we do next? I might want to do docks next, I think. I give them giant clams. Oh, I don't have enough giant clams. Oh, I thought this was going to be the moment. I feel like Poncho is going to give it to me next. Hey, Anne, do you know what Tamagotchi life is? Nope. I only know what the old school Tamagotchis, the little clip-on things are. I don't know. I already completed my fossil section. Oh yeah, same. I just, every time. I just saved up all my fossils and I just gave it all of them. But I ran out, so I'm like, all right. It's fine. It's fine. All right, Doc, are you home? Doc, are you home? Doc's not home. I think Doc is back by the plaza. Is Blue Bear home? I forgot this is like an inaccessible way to go. Imagine you autofill. Oh my god, I would love that. If I autofill all orange and red villagers and I get to do my arson core island, I'll be so excited. I will be pumped. I'll be ecstatic. Alright, Blue Bear's house, which we did, but it's not. It'll be customized tomorrow. Hey, congrats on finishing your island. I'm not there yet, but almost. Almost. Yes, don't forget to like the stream if you haven't already. All right, Miss Blue Bear. Maybe Blue Bear will give me her picture. So can I come and tour your island for a video? Yes, absolutely. Absolutely you can. What if I get the ugliest villagers ever? Then it's gonna be a really ugly island, isn't it? It'll be real ugly. Did I just sign in with my... <laughs> Thank you for the double like. You're so nice. Thank you. Photo? <sighs> Come on, bestie. Come on, bestie. You know you want to give me your photo. You know you want to. I'm not quite. Um, oh, oh, not quite. I'm cleaning up my island, getting ready to restart. Nice. 11 more likes to 100. Nine more likes and you get a spot. You get a crazy story. You get the craziest story I've ever told. So once you autofill and think of a theme to go with the villagers, um, nope, I will keep the 10 villagers that autofill. The only rule, the only way I don't keep a villager is if I've had them in the past. Except if it's Walker, because he's my favorite villager, so I'll keep him again. But everyone else, I keep all 10 villagers and have to make a theme out of it. That's the challenge. Is Bam home? I don't think Bam is home. So it's gonna be really fun if they all don't match. Bam, are you home? Bam, where are you? Where are you? And I'm so sorry. <laughs> I forgot that the beaches are decorated now. I'm like, oh my God, there's stuff on the beaches. <laughs> there's stuff on the beaches. And I'm so sorry. Oh, I have to go say Naomi too. This is not what I want. <laughs> yes, la who last night? Why was I so unhinged? Why was I so unhinged with the singing last night? Do you guys remember what I was just singing? Um, I was singing Les Mis all last night, and I was like singing The Greatest Showman, and I was like making fun of like how Hugh Jackman sings. Who let me do that? Who let me do that? Mash it up. I can't. I can't. <laughs> I'm not talented enough. Oh my god. Every five minutes I was just like, Hello there, my name's Gavroche. Like, who let me do that? Who let me do that for like an hour? 
Who allowed me? How? Who allowed me to do that? Hmm? I'm so, and I'm so sorry. This is not what I want. This is not what I planned. <gasps> Holiday core would be fun. And I just have to say, yeah, I'm gonna change my flag. I do not understand. Also, my frogs, dogs, coconut songs. My EP is coming out soon. My EP of my frog, dog, coconut songs. Give me your photo. <laughs> coming out soon. Those were unhinged too. Who let me do that? G remind me not to like sing next time. <gasps> I love Naomi. Oh, EP is like a mini album. I'm joke. It's a joke. Cause I was I made up like four different songs while I was playing Sabotage League, and I was like, I'm gonna drop the EP with the songs. Doc, you're gonna give me your photo, right? We like your singing. <laughs> Thank you. Then one of my songs was me just singing the song from Titanic, but with frogs, dogs, coconuts in it. Give me your photo. Give me your photo. Okay, but it's a wall. Whenever they give you a wallpaper, you're like almost there. It's like you're so close. My heart will go on, but it was tight. Yeah, but it was like I was singing frogs, dogs, coconuts. And then after that, we were talking about Titanic. And I accidentally said, why the heck does Rose throw the necklace in the river at the end? Uh, I meant to say ocean. And everyone made fun of me. Everyone's like, did you just say river? And I was like, no. Who am I missing? I just didn't see Bam, right? All right, well, if we see Bam, we see Bam. But let's move on. Just be mindful of the all caps, guys, please. If you're coming in, just make sure you read the rules on your way in. Make sure you read the rules. The rules, the rules, the rules. Okay, awesome. All right, let's do um, a villager house. Let's do a villager house. I think let's do docks. What if we did docks? I feel like that'd be kind of cute. Let's do docks. I don't know where you, somewhere, probably on Netflix, maybe. Titanic's gotta be somewhere, right? It's gotta be somewhere. I don't know. In fact, I don't know. It's like a four hour movie. It's really long. You've never seen Titanic either. It's sad, guys. It's just as sad as you think it's gonna be. It's sad. The rules. The rules. Okay, let's do Doc's house. Two part VHS from Blockbuster. That's how you know it's long. That's how you know you've never seen Titanic either? How have you got- <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. All right, there's a poll. Who's seen Titanic? I feel like a staggering number of you have- I'm Gen Z, I've seen Titanic. I've seen Titanic multiple times. We need to see how many of you haven't seen Titanic. Too many of you have never seen Titanic. What? You guys are nuts. Oh my god. It's a long movie, okay? Listen. I know it's, it's said Peyton, but I never cry for movies. Really? I always cry. It came on two VHS tapes because it was so long. Yeah. It was super popular when I was in high school, so I became I was being a contrarian. <laughs> Guys, the boat sinks. I'm so sorry to spoil it. Leo dies. Like I'm, I'm really sorry. I think under like 21, maybe. I feel like, I mean, you all know what it is, though, right? Like you all know what it is. It was like the first adult movie I watched away from my parents with my aunt. Really? I don't remember the first time I watched it. I probably watched it, like, with my mom, but I don't remember. I'm shocked. I'm shocked. 
I feel like I wouldn't be able to watch the whole thing and move around a lot when I ever watch movies and can't concentrate. It's a long time. It's a long time, okay? It's good. But here's the thing. It's like a three-hour movie. The boat doesn't sink until the last hour. So you got a whole two hours before the boat even sinks. You know what I mean? Um, shocked and sad. The movie's so good. It is so good. Three hours and 14 minutes. Oh, hi, Dexter. Hi, are you coming for my ankles? Are you coming for my ankle, puppy? Are you feeling okay? You feeling okay, baby? Dexter looks so sleepy right now. Um, well, I can't believe... It's on Netflix. All right, guys, everyone go watch the Titanic. <laughs> go watch the Titanic, you know. Okay, I don't hate Doc's exterior. However, it is too brown. Aw, Dexter's licking my ankles. Thank you with your yucky throw-up mouth. That's okay. It's okay, Dexter. Anything for you. Anything for you. Um, I wish there was like a... I wish there were better blue options. Mm. I feel like the, this, this style is the best, but mm, I don't like this one. And I have already used both of these ones already. I guess it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if I make it different. Okay, I'm going to close this poll. I'm going to close this poll. But wow. But wow. Can't believe it, guys. Will there be a Dexter minute? Dexter's been here the whole time. I'm just not going to pick him up because he was sick at the beginning of the stream. So I am not going to pick him up because I don't want to rock the boat. Hey, Jen. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. White or yellow? For what? What, make his house yellow? I think that's too much. Make Might make the door yellow. Keep in mind he's like the therapist, so I don't want it to be too bright. The house thing, that's not the roof? What do you mean? You want me to make his house yellow? You want me to make his house yellow? None of the houses are yellow. So it would be different. Door yellow. Door yellow or house yellow? I kind of like the house being yellow. What if the house is yellow? What if the house is yellow? Because this is like his house that he had before, but now it's yellow. Well, it's cute. I kind of like it. I'm kind of into it. I don't know necessarily if Rio is rare, but they're a new villager. Yeah, I like it. I like it. Cool. I like it. All right, let's do this interior. All right. I like that we're breaking up the interiors a little bit. Since he's a shrink, yellow is supposed to be uplifting. Yeah, for sure. For sure, for sure. Now, will I continue the starry night wall in... Oh my god, his house right now. It's got a lot going on. All the villagers are rare to someone. Like, why does he have a toilet? Like, who did this? Who did this? Get this all out of here. 95 like hype! Oh my god, so close to the spiciest story I've ever told. This, this story that's too spicy for the stream, but I'm going to tell it anyway. Alright. I think... I think I like doing the starry thing. I didn't do it for Naomi, but I did give her a window anyway, so I think it's okay. Part of me wants to go and redo Naomi's, because I did the same thing for everyone else. Okay, where is the star wall? I mean, the rain wall is kind of good. I got him from an order bot. I got him from an order bot. I feel like there aren't enough blue wallpaper options. 
Oh, that one's kind of nice for him. I'm eating Takis. <laughs> Doc's our unique buddy. Let's give him a cute... Well, I feel like he's not that cute and quirky, though. I feel like... Maybe I do want it to be yellow. The yellow might be kind of fun. Maybe I do want it to be a little funky. Maybe I do. Not... Oh, God. That's too much. That's too much. One more like. One more like. So you have the best ideas. You do. Because he's the therapist. So I want it to be like, he's got a place to study. But also it's got to be like somewhat fun, I guess. A <gasps> hundred likes. Okay. All right. All right. I'll tell you the story. I'm going to tell you the frog story. They told me not to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to tell you the frog story. Okay. Now, I will give a warning. This is a violent graphic story. So, don't say I didn't warn you. Okay? Don't say I didn't warn you and I do not condone any of the actions that happened in this story. Thank you for licking my ankles, Dexter. That's so nice of you. So here's what ha happened, okay? Keep in mind, I'm like, I am like seven years old or something like that. I had, M for mature, for sure. My next door neighbor was my best friend and him and I always would catch frogs together. In the neighborhood we lived in, for some reason, there were a lot of frogs. He was very, he still is, um, he's very, into animals <laughs> he probably feels horrible about this now um he was very into animals and he always caught the frogs and would like teach me about the frogs and like keep them in like tanks and like take care of them and stuff and all blah 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 and i was kind of scared of the frogs so there was one day and i was never able to catch the frogs he always caught them i never got to catch one there was one day i caught a frog and i named him raimundo this is why we brought that story up because we talked about that one Cartoon Network show, the something something showdown show, and there was a character called Raimundo, and I liked that name, so we named our frog Raimundo. I can't believe I'm telling this story. <laughs> okay, so we named the frog Raimundo. We loved Raimundo. We hung out with Raimundo all day. We we're having a good time with him, playing in the backyard with him, and then we decided Raim Raimundo was like X Games mode. So I had this really tall lounge chair that was in my backyard. We decided, what if we put him on top of the really tall lounge chair and then like make him jump off? So we did. And he jumped off of the really tall lounge chair and he fell onto the hard concrete. And um, then he wasn't jumping around so much after that. So my neighbor and I, panicked we did not know what to do the only logical thing we could do was to give him mouth to mouth um i did not give him mouth to mouth my neighbor did <laughs> but i fully encouraged this fully encouraged that my neighbor give the frog cpr mouth to mouth both things he did both things um no more hopping for Raimundo. So, what? Why did we end up doing what we did? I know what happens, but I don't remember what the logic was. So, oh, that's a new one. That's a new one. <laughs> okay. Um, I don't remember what, how this ended up happening. But... He wasn't moving anymore, so we decided to... Oh, you see Dexter? Dexter's hanging around. We decided to bury him in the backyard, uh, which we did. We buried him, and then we didn't check on him for like a couple hours because we thought he was dead because he jumped to his death. The CPR didn't... This, the mouth-to-mouth -mouth didn't work. Um, we thought he was no longer with us so we decided to bury him and give him a little funeral 
Um, and then for some reason, a couple hours later, we were inclined to check on him. So we dug him up and then he got up, he hopped and then no hop. And then we felt so bad that we buried the frog alive. Um, I can't even say what we did. I didn't do it, but I didn't stop it. I didn't do it, but I didn't stop it. We felt so bad that the frog was not dead. So we buried him again. But this time we put, we like hit the spot with a really big brick. And then, and then we said, we sang, we said goodbye. And keep in mind, I didn't do it. I didn't do it. <laughs> but I was a part of it. And I'm told this was the worst thing I ever did. This was the worst thing. Who told us to do that? Where was the parental supervision? I don't know why we did that. I don't know why we did that. Didn't that take a horrible turn? Why did we do that? I was seven. I was seven. And I cried. I cried for so long. I cried to the point where I am so scarred from it still. You should have just eaten it. No. <laughs> I was so scarred from this. I'm still talking about it. I could not believe that we did that. Again, I didn't do it, but I didn't stop it. I was like, I guess that makes sense. Guys, isn't that horrible? All right, everyone leaves the stream now. That is the worst thing. I ever did that's yesterday I was telling the story of me getting a tattoo nope this was the worst thing Th that was the spiciest worst thing we don't come we don't condone animal mistreatment here if you find a frog outside just like leave it just like leave it I don't know what the logic was I don't know why we both were like ah yes let us oh I didn't drink okay um I don't know why we thought, well, because we felt bad that we buried it alive. So we're like, well, let's make sure it's really. <laughs> I had no, I felt so bad. I cried for so long and I was like, mom, like, am I a horrible person? Like, I, and my mom was like, you're horrible for making him kiss the frog. Like you, you guys didn't mean to, like he jumped off of the big tall thing. You didn't know. At seven, you still have no mental concept of permanent consequences, so you get a little bit of forgiveness. Okay. As long as I get a little bit. Yeah, that's the ho most horrible thing. Isn't that horrible? Anyway, well, that was my frog story. <laughs> you all wanted it. <laughs> uh, you all wanted it. I don't condone the behavior. The Prince Charming did not appear. Um, luckily, my neighbor did not get any kind of warts on his lips from doing mouth to mouth to the frog. Thank goodness, uh, he could have. What story would I tell at 150 likes? I have no idea. No, I, some, could it get any spicier? I have no idea. I'll have to think of something. I'll have to think of something. I'll have to think of something. I'm sweating, guys. <laughs> I was like seven, okay? I was like seven. I didn't know. I didn't know, all right? I didn't know, I'm still grieving Raimundo. I will, I'll tell you some story. I'll think of something. I'll think of something until then. I, I'm still dealing with the guilt of what happened to Raimundo. So at least I feel bad about it, right? Uh, like, it would be worse if I didn't feel bad about it. That was worth 100 likes. <laughs> I told you it takes a turn. Like you thought the um, you thought the uh, the bad part was the mouth to mouth with the frog. No. So I'm not. You can read my rules if you come into my chat. You can like read my rules, and I always say a good indication of what I'm doing in the stream is if you look at the title. So if I was visiting islands, that would be in the title. It's not in the title. Sirens and beeps. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> Except the title is kind of clickbaity today. So sorry. Whose idea was it to make the title this? Who, whose idea was it again? 
<laughs> you missed the story guys was the story worth it was the story worth it or was it uh was it horrific it was pretty horrific i think but i thought that the bad part the the you thought that the bad part was that we put him on top of the really tall chair yeah the frog died the frog did die but the way that the long story the, the the abridged version was we found a frog we loved the frog we named him raimundo me and my neighbor played with him all day had a great time we put him on top of a really tall chair because we thought he could do x games mode he jumped off the really tall chair he suddenly was no longer hopping around so we decided to give him mouth to mouth i didn't give him mouth to mouth my neighbor did but i encouraged it didn't work we decided to bury him we decided to check on him a few laters after we buried him and he took one more hop and then stopped hopping so we felt so bad that we buried him alive that we buried him again but we smashed the spot with a really heavy brick first and i'm still suffering with the guilt of those actions Again, I didn't do any of this, but I, I didn't I didn't stop it, so I'm just as guilty. Anyway, that's the story. <laughs> that's the story. That's what happened. <laughs> so I forever I am forever sorry for my actions. I'm forever sorry for my actions. I love animals. Let's bring up the pictures of the yaks again. Let's look at the yaks. Let's go save the yaks. I love the yaks. We love the frogs. We don't hurt animals. Seven-year-old Peyton made some bad choices. Look at the yaks. We save the yaks. Peyton's corner is now. <laughs> we save yaks. Uh, anyway. <laughs> uh, I just want to save the yaks, okay? That's it. At least you learned from it. I'm still scarred from it. Yes, that's why. That's what. That's why I. That's why the yaks are on the screen. That is why we're saving the yaks, Lauren. Because that's what I was talking about last night. I was like, can you believe this is happening? I'm going to Wyoming. I'm getting all of those yaks. I'm saving them. I'm saving them. I think you know I'm a training therapist. I'm here for you to work through. <laughs> when you're ready i'm gonna need to i'm scared of frogs now i'm scared of them i want to see them i oh my god i need to make a yak command i can't i can't that's why i was talking about it because i was like guys listen to this horrible thing that's happening with these yaks you know i was like uh... What is happening? Oh wait, um, I think I wanna do this instead. I want like, lights. Maybe I don't. The frog could have dug himself out. He couldn't have because he was injured from the X Games. Pain when she sees a frog fell <laughs> Um, frogs, dogs, coconuts. <laughs> I don't know if I like those up here. You saw the poll about Titanic? You saw both the movies. I've actually never seen the musical, surprisingly. I couldn't believe that many of you guys hadn't seen Titanic, though. No, I know. That's why I was like, we can't talk about this too much, because I don't want to talk about Jeffree Star, but I do want to talk about this yak problem. I want to talk about the yaks. You missed the frog story? It was traumatic. It's traumatic, I think. Um, actually, I will put the book the books there i will put the books there well i'll have to think of a good story for 150 likes if we get to that we could we might we might i feel like i don't know if i want these to be the same or different um and i think we're gonna do this <gasps> mars how are you i hope you're doing so good welcome in welcome in what is up what is up what is up Oh, uh, I gotta think of another story. That was my spicy story. That was my spicy one. Meanwhile, you're making a cloud coat? Oh my god, that sounds so nice. Oh, actually, I think maybe the books would be better back here. 
I was sleeping, so I missed the beginning of the stream. No worries. It's all good. No, we didn't bury him deep. Nope. We were seven. We were like seven. We had no idea what we were doing. We were like, oh no, this frog. We need to take care of it. And it was like very little. Searching for sure for so long. I'm considering spicing him, but I don't want to have my Nook Mile search be a waste. Yeah, that's the struggle. That's the struggle. I believe you'll find him. There's not that many goats. You got this. You can do it. I think Koi changed it. I didn't change it. Koi changed it. Koi changed it. Because I said, I was like, oh, we should really change that command. And Koi was like, okay, I did it. It's like, oh, okay, cool. Uh, I feel like this is such like a desk lamp. It's such a desk lamp. Maybe I'll put an alarm clock back there. If you were an alarm clock, where would you be? Okay. Oh, maybe the yellow. Cute. It's giving me Doc. I think Doc needs like a desk. Doc needs like a desk somewhere. Not there, but somewhere. Somewhere only we know. Yeah. Doc with the desk. Give me a cute little stool. Give me a cute little stool. Or like a school chair, maybe? Do I like a school chair? He's my little therapist, studious boy, you know? I kind of like it. I kind of like it. Um, and I think I know what I want to put here. I feel like I've given you every spicy story. I feel like I gotta think of more. More that are appropriate for the stream is what I mean. I always like matching everything. Is that weird? Do you guys always match these things? I always like to match the bedspread. Just start make. That's true. I really could make them up and you would have no idea. I don't want to though. The story of how I met Alex is not that spicy though. I'm glad to tell that story. Um, well, kids, there's a cute little app. <laughs> there's a cute little app called Bumble that Miss Peyton was on and Alex was on. And in case you don't know what that is, it's a dating app. And Pepe wasn't trying to seriously talk to any boys. She just like wanted to see what happened, you know? And uh, then she saw this cute boy and he only had two pictures too. But I kind of had like my idealized, like what my dream boy looked like. And it was pretty much what Alex looks like. So I was like, huh, he kind of looks like my dream boy, kind of. He had like nothing in his bio other than the fact that he, um, like how old he was and that he like played the guitar. And he was like a, um, he was like what college he was in and that he was studying like tech but i was like okay there's not that much here but like i got this vibe so i started talking to him and he was really nice and i slid into his dms because with bumble that's like how it works like i could i got to slide into his dms first and i said something about like oh when are you gonna play me a song and then he asked me if I wanted to meet up in person like right away. And at first I was sussed out. I was like, I don't know, I know nothing about you. Um, so I like kind of swerved him at first. I was like, oh, I don't know. But then I just had this feeling and I was like, well, what if I just went? And so he asked me out again and we'd only been talking like so briefly. So I knew, no I knew like nothing about him. And we met up in Brooklyn. I was living in Manhattan at the time and 
I used to have bright red hair. So I was like, okay, I'm going to be standing in front of here. I have bright red hair. He won't miss me. And I remember he walked up to me and at first I didn't think he liked, I thought he was really cute. I didn't think he liked me because he was really flustered because he forgot the directions of where he was going to take me. So the first like 15 or so minutes while we were trying to find this restaurant, like we, it was like very like awkward. But then as soon as we sat down in the restaurant, I'll never forget. He sat down, he was wearing sunglasses. So he took off his sunglasses and he just, we just like looked at each other and I was like, oh, wait, Pepe didn't expect to fall in love today. Uh, and then our date was supposed to just be us getting food and then going home. We ended up getting food and then walking through Prospect Park together until like two in the morning, just like talking, and, like hanging out in the park together. And then um, we both stopped using the app after that night. And four years later, here we are, here we are. Yeah, she did take a risk, but yeah, it was uh, very unexpected for both of us, for both of us, like he wasn't expecting it either. Um, yeah, but very cute, very cute. And now every year on anniversary, we go back to that place we went to. And I can't walk through Prospect Park that long anymore. And the past couple years, the weather's been really bad, but we want to like go back to where we were. Because it was funny, I had gone through like a really bad breakup right before I moved to the city, which wasn't even a full year before I met Alex. And I remember I gone through this really bad breakup. It was my first ever boyfriend. And right before I moved to college, I had like a last hangout with my friends. And we were at one of my friends' beach house. And, um, I, or a lake house, I don't know. I, but we were just hanging out, like looking out at the stars, talking about our future. And I saw this swan come out of nowhere. And at first it was by itself for a little bit. And then a second swan came in and followed it. And I kind of took it as like a good luck sign. And when I was on my date with Alex, when we were hanging out in the park, right before literally right before our first kiss a s swan came out of nowhere so i was like and now we always get little swans and like they're like lame um but yeah pretty crazy pretty crazy stuff oh you met your boyfriend on tinder i like it can happen like you wouldn't think like, i feel like you never know you never know i didn't expect it but here we are now we have a little puppy too right puppy yeah, sleepy. Dexter is out cold sleeping. Out cold. Out cold. I think I want... <gasps> you find like a Pappy's photo? I love Pappy. Cute, right? I know. There's not a yellow computer. That's annoying. It's fine. He's okay. <laughs> Okay, um, I don't know what else I want to put in this room. John and I went on our first date to a tattoo shop. <gasps> you got tattooed together, not matching though? I feel like that's so risky though. Oh my god. <laughs> I feel like that is risky though. I would be scared because then I would, what if, then I would always like associate the tattoo with, um, with the other person. I don't know if I want to have a... I think I want to have like a reading space. I think I want to have like a reading space. Oh, <gasps> you auto filled Sherb. Look at you. Okay. Look at you, Sherb. I love Sherb. I think I want to do this. Do some of this. Best day ever. I can't imagine. Well, Alex has no tattoos. So, first of all, that would have never happened. <laughs> But, um, I can't imagine. You guys are daredevils, you. It's crazy. Crazy. Does this look insane? Yeah, it does. It does look insane. That looks insane, too. I will put a plant there. Then I will put a, I will put a plant there. I will put a plant. That sounds like a fun date. I had not with my boyfriend another first date i went on oh it wasn't our first date i think it was like my second date with this one guy he took me to have breakfast at tiffany's we went outside tiffany's like the jewelry shop and we had breakfast together 
and I was like, this is like right after I moved to New York, and I was like, am I in a movie? I was like, how did I get here? In retrospect, it was a cute idea, but like also weird because we were just like standing on the sidewalk, like eating a muffin. So, but you know, cute idea, cute idea. Yeah, because um, Tiffin, like the movie Breakfast at Tiffany's, so it's like Tiffany's jewelry store, and she would eat breakfast outside of the jewelry store, and like fantasize about this like glamorous life, and uh, that's what we did. Welcome back, Bay. Welcome back. Hope you're doing good. You know I'm just doing these cushions everywhere. <laughs> I just put these cushions everywhere. I think I want to do like a rocking chair or something too here. Reading chair here. Oh, but then he can't sit in it if I put this there. So we'll put this. You never saw that? It's really problematic. So like, it, it don't watch it. Um, but you know, cute I cute idea. Cute idea, just very problematic stuff in that movie now. Um, hi, Gregory, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing good. I'm surprised. It was with Audrey Hepburn. It's like a hugely famous movie. It's like a huge. So you all have seen the Lego movie, but you've never seen Breakfast at Tiffany's or Titanic? What? You guys are nuts. How? Hi, Wolfie, what's up, what's up? It's it's such a classic, such a classic. Now you're gonna tell me, I'm gonna like list off all of my classic theatrical ones and y'all not gonna know what it is. Yes, I have seen the movie. It's good except for the fact that they do a majorly, um, they do like a majorly racist thing in the movie, um, which was unnecessary because it doesn't affect the whole plot at all. But um, taking the book and all of that, that's not in there. So still, still like the story, but why they need to ruin good things, I don't know. I don't know. You've seen, you've seen both. Can confirm I've seen Titanic and Breakfast at Tiffany's. Love it. Love it. Love it, love it. What else? Have you guys ever seen Sunset Boulevard? You guys know Sunset Boulevard? Sunset Boulevard. Tell me you've seen Sunset Boulevard. Have you? Someone has. Someone has seen Sunset Boulevard, right? Right? Someone has. I know someone has. Yes? <gasps> nice. It's so good. It's so good. Not me. It's so good. The musical, too? good good stuff huh? never seen it is it it's an old movie it's the black and white movie it's so good oh my god when i get older dream roll dream roll hello my queen oh kayla's streaming right now tell k oh if you go back tell kayla i say hi thank you guys for moving the chat along movies consist of marvel star wars and lego stuff okay but watch sunset boulevard it's good it's about a crazy old hollywood film star it's good crazy it's like a black and white old school movie that and all about eve <sighs> so good so good tell me it's not so good my mom and i used to have like um we would have like movie movie picnics on her room like in her room like on sundays and we would um get a bunch of snacks and watch like either when i was younger it was barbie movies but then when i got older it was like older movies i have seen the breakfast club i have not seen the other two i know them though i know they're all 80s movies some days i just alternate between Marilyn and judy garland movies oh my god yeah sunset boulevard is so good it's so good I went through a Danny, Danny K phase as a teen. I love him. Any of his movies are just plain comfort to me. Danny K. What name? What movies? Because I probably, I'm sure I know the movies, but I don't know the director. I probably do. I've only seen The Breakfast Club one time, though. I will say. Kayla says, "Hey, bestie." I love Kayla. Kayla's great. Breakfast Club's your favorite film ever. I like it. I've only seen it the one time, though. 
I'm trying to think of what my favorite 80s movies is. Um, oh, I don't know what my favorite 80s movie is. I feel like off the top of my head, I don't know. When did Dirty Dancing come out? When did Dirty Dancing come out? Was that the 80s? Was that after, before that? When was that? 87, yeah. Then it's Dirty Dancing. Easy. 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 87. 87! Google said 87! 87. I'm going with it. I'm going with it. More of a sci-fi fantasy person. I like old school horror movies. No, my favorite 80s movies are like the old school horror movies. Because I love like the old school ones. I don't even really like new horror movies. All of them. It's all of them. So good. Dang, I'm old. No, you're not old. I mean, Back to the Future is a great one, too. A great one. I love... Oh, my God. Heathers! Of course! Uh, stop it. I, I cosplayed as JD to school one time. I'm... Come on, Peyton. Come on, Peyton. I literally cosplayed as JD to school. I went to a performing arts school, so it wasn't that weird, but like... Yeah. Oh my god, I love Heathers. Love Heathers so much. Do I want a rug? Why have I not used the star fragment rug for anybody? Oh, 13 going on 30 is my like my favorite. That's not an 80s movie though. That's like when did that come out? 2000s, right? That's my favorite romantic. No. My favorite okay. 2004, 13 Going on 30 came out. Um, my favorite romantic comedy is tied between 13 Going on 30 and How to Lose a Guy in 10 Days. Both of them are my favorite. My favorite. Those are my favorite rom-coms. Those are 2000s, though. Those are 2000s. I'm trying to think of more, like, 80s ones, though, because my mom is an 80s lady. His house looks so cute. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm having fun with it. I like it. It's very, it's like studious, but it's also very like kitty and he's a lazy boy. So I feel like it works. Why not talk about 80s and 90s movies? They're good. I've never seen the Goonies. That's why. I said then, I know. Alex has said that too. Alex has been like, how have you never seen? Wait, when did the Little Rascals come out? Um, did you guys like, I love, did you watch the Little Rascals? Did you watch the Little Rascals? I loved it. I've never seen The Goonies. Can you believe it? Alex couldn't believe it either. Do you know what else I'd never seen? I'd never seen Home Alone. I had to watch it with Alex, like, recently. I've never, I'd never seen it. To be fair, he's never seen A Christmas Story, so, like, whatever. <gasps> that was 90s. So good. I loved it. I, wait. Oh, did my door just open? No, we're good. Um, I know what it is, though. I just have never seen it. Mm -hmm. You know what I always confuse the Goonies with? Which I have seen. I've seen the Gremlins. I've seen that. With the little Furby looking things. I've seen that. Guys, I've also never seen Jurassic Park. So like, what do you, what do you expect? I've also literally never seen Jurassic Park. I've only seen the remake with Chris Pratt. Not even, I haven't even seen Star Wars. Like, Gremlins classic. I liked the Gremlins, though. Peyton, what? Uh, all right, Pepe. <laughs> there are so many good Christmas movies. There are so many good Christmas movies. What? Uh, Josh Bono. <laughs> I saw the reboot um, with Kylo Ren. I was dragged to the theater. Kay Daisy! Hey, what's up, Kay? We need to make you a command. We need to make Kay a command. Guys, go check. You all know Kay's channel. I know you're already subscribed, but in case you're not. Dude, Jurassic Park is so good. Okay, I watched the... Do you guys watch that show on Netflix that is the um, the movies that made us and they talk about the process of getting the movies made? Um, I watched that one for Jurassic Park and it was so interesting. Uh, even though I've never actually seen the movie. <laughs> I, I know what happens though. Like, you know what I mean? It's like Titanic. Like we were saying before, if you've never seen... You know what Titanic is. You're actively procrastinating. That's... 
listen, me too. That's that's how I feel every day, bestie. That's how I feel every day. I feel every day. My first time going to cinema was to see Jerry. Oh, really? Oh, I don't remember what my first movie was. Probably something stupid. <laughs> I saw the one with Chris Pratt, though. I think they made two of them, though. I only saw the one. It was just okay. It was just okay. Peyton, you need to watch the actual good Star Wars movies. And the animated ones, oh my god. You saw Jurassic at the cinema, like, three times? I probably, I mean, like, I probably saw it, but I don't remember it. Because I'm sure my brother would have watched it as a kid. Same thing with, like, Indiana Jones. I've never seen that either. Never seen that either. But I'm sure my brother has. So, like, perhaps it was on and I just wasn't watching it. I don't know. I've certainly never seen the Lego movie. Never. Mm -mm. <gasps> yes, thank you for making that command, Jen. Thank you so much, my friend. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Um, yeah. To be, to be fair, the book is much scarier. Of what? Jurassic Park? Maybe I'll read the book. I've never seen Lord of the Rings. I've never seen Lord of the Rings. Or Harry Potter. I've never seen Harry Potter either. That one, I think, is the one that surprises people. That one, I think, is the one that surprises people. They're like, no, you give Harry Potter energy. And I'm like, I don't know what that means, but okay. I didn't even know Jurassic Park was a book. I'm so out of it. I'm so out of it. Okay, I'll read it just for you. I gotta get going watching these movies, I guess. I guess so. I was spending all my time as a child just re-watching Psycho for the millionth time like a weirdo. You crossed the line without watching Harry Potter. I feel like it's too late for me now. It's too late now. You know? It's too late for me now. I've gone this long. I did see every Twilight movie, though. <laughs> I did see every single Twilight movie. Several times. So... I guess that's where my priorities lied. You know, I guess that's that's what we were doing. Okay, you can't shame me for never seeing Titanic if you've never seen Star Wars, Lord of the Wing Rings, Jurassic Park, Harry Potter, or the Lego movie. Okay. All right. But you've never seen Titanic. What do you mean? Why would you watch Twilight and not Harry Potter? I don't know. Uh, no, I do know. I, I really like Taylor Lautner. That's why I watched them. That's why I watch them. This is Doc's house. We're doing all of the things that need to be left, that were <laughs> left till the end for my island. And that is including my villager houses. So this is Doc's house. And um, we're gonna finish this one. Then we're gonna take a break from the villager interiors, do some more stuff we gotta do. And that's what we're doing. <gasps> Barry, hey, can I just say Sunset Boulevard is one of my favorites? Yes, the taste. The taste is so good. I love it. I love Sunset Boulevard. I love Doc so much. Doc is so underrated. He's such a little baby. I know I'm using a lot of this pattern. I don't care. I don't care. Actually, I think I want to do this too. I think I want to do... I need that starry wall. I know, I need it in my life. I need it in my real life. I think I kind of want to do this business. Um, but maybe gold. Maybe gold. He's, he's, his house has the most yellow so far, but I kind of like it. I kind of like that for him. Um. Yeah, I guess I gotta watch a lot of these. What's another, like, classic movie that every person... I've never seen The Godfather. And I am an Italian from New Jersey, so I feel like that is probably a uh, bad thing. It's probably a bad thing. But, you know. <gasps> Doc is not ugly at all. Should we put Van Gogh on the walls? Let's put Van Gogh on the walls. I've never seen it. I've never seen The Sopranos either. My family has. You wouldn't know. My whole family has, like... I've never seen Pulp Fiction either. I've never seen it either. I know what it is. We love Uma Thurman. I've never seen it. I have seen The Nightmare Before Christmas. I have seen that many times. Um, I'm trying to think of like another one that people are always mad at me when I tell them I haven't seen it. My favorite TV show was a little show called Smash. 
It was a show about Broadway. It was canceled after two seasons. I'm still not over it. Pulp Fiction is the only good Quentin Tarantino movie. Yeah, he creeps me out. He gives me the creeps. He gives me such creepy vibes. But I have heard... Isn't Kill Bill him, though? Is Don't people like that? I've never seen that either. Never seen The Lost Boys. I love Smash 2. <laughs> I've never watched Naruto. I've never seen it. I'm so sorry. Um, but I know they are bringing Smash to Broadway and they need to cast me as um, chorus girl number two or something. Never seen Fight Club. I've never seen Fight Club. I have seen Shrek. I have seen Shrek. I have never seen Fight Club. I've never seen... I'm trying to think of like the most quotable movies ever. I don't think I need to put something up here. Haven't seen Naruto either. Uh, please just be mindful of the all caps, guys. I did grow up watching uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! and Pokemon, though, a lot. So, if that's any consolation. Oh, I love the Princess Bride stuff! Okay, some of you know, some of you know that I have a really embarrassing, um, spicy teenage drama series I tried to write as a child. And it was about, like, a hot bank robber. And I named him Wesley because of the Princess Bride. So, yes, I've seen it many a times. Inconceivable. So many times. It's a classic. It's one of my mom's favorite movies. So, for sure I've seen it. Listen, that's where the name originated from. Yeah, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, guys. I'm just exposing myself today. Today and every day. We're gonna do the brain picture too. We're gonna do two of the brain pictures. If my mom was an 80s kid, that makes sense. Yeah, mm, she was. Mm, 80s teen. An 80s teen she was. Okay, I don't think I need to put anything on that wall. Do I? It looks empty though. Maybe we do some of this. Maybe we do some of this. Yeah, Princess Bride is so good. I've also seen The Princess Diaries. Don't worry, guys. Don't worry, I've seen The Princess Diaries. I've seen every Anne Hathaway movie. I've seen Ella Enchanted. I have seen The Devil Wears Prada. I've seen all of the Anne Hathaway movies. I know you were worried, don't worry. I've seen them all. I've seen them all. I've also, I'm trying to think of like, I've never seen um, Alien. I've never seen that movie. I have seen, I've never seen The Labyrinth. Okay, this is Doc's house. I think it's cute. I like it. I kind of like those things up top. They kind of look like they're sitting on top of the shelves. Look at me and Tom Nook, it's pretty intimate. Wait, you've never watched Ella Enchanted? Okay, the guy, guys, the guy in Ella Enchanted? The crush I had on him? Immense. Okay, I think I'm done with this one. I like this. I'm surprised I've never seen The Labyrinth. I feel like I would have liked it. I mean, it's not too late. I can watch it, but like, it feels missed. It feels like a missed opportunity. You know? I like the robot. You don't like the robot clock? I think the robot clock's quite cute. It's kind of cute. Labyrinth is great. Maybe I gotta watch it. I have seen all of the Back to the Futures. I have seen them. I didn't watch them until later in life, though. I, like, missed them as a child, somehow. So. Um, let us do this. Let us time travel a day forward. Let me order some stuff really quick. Time travel a day forward. Gift my villagers some stuff. Finish another beach and then do another villager interior. I think I need um, more duckies, toy ducks, and more cushions. If we if we if we reach two hundred likes, I'll tell you another spicy story, but I don't know what. Toy duck. I had such a crush on Michael J. Fox back in the day. Oh yeah. How could you not? He was like that kind of like cool dude, like for sure. 
Yes, David Bowie was awesome in that movie. I've seen like clips of it, and it looked really good. It looked really good. I've seen every Scooby-Doo. Oh, I've seen every Scooby-Doo. Oh, Modern Shadows, thank you for subscribing. Thanks for being a sloth. No, you know I've seen every Scooby-Doo. You know she wanted to be a hex girl. Like, you know, like, stop this. You know, you know. Um, I want the Zen cushions too. I'm just gonna type in Zen. I can't see where I'm typing, great. <gasps> Thanks for being here, my friend. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So much love, so much love to you. So much love. Um, yeah. I don't know, my childhood crush was Hayden, Cl oh, I don't know who that is. I don't know who that is. Is that, is that, um, I have no idea who that is. Huh? Is he the man who played baby hot Darth Vader? <gasps> Hi, Cozy Rosie, welcome in, what's up? If you guys aren't already subscribed to my friend Rosie, but why not? Why not? You should. You're coming into some chaos. My crush is food, same. Oh, same. What, is that not right? Isn't he hot Darth Vader? Isn't that who he is? That's hot, and that's hot Darth Vader, isn't it? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, I've never seen it. All I know is Kylo Ren, because I saw the new one, but only one of them. Hi, good morning or evening or night. Hello, good morning or evening or night to you too. I mean, yeah, I'm right, so what do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> Listen, I spent all my time watching Barbie's Princess and the Popper. That's what I was doing with my time. Right, hot little Darth Vader. I thought it was, I was one of those people that was, thought he was dark, dark Vader until like a couple of years ago, and then I was yelled at. Just yelled at. I know, with a TH. It's because when I grew up on Fairly Odd Parents, there was a villain called Dark Laser, and I knew it was supposed to be a play on Darth Vader, but that's what I was familiar with, so I thought that's why. I thought that's what it was. I didn't know. Listen, I didn't know. Pet peeve? I'm, that, I'm sure it is. I'm sure it is. <laughs> I've also never seen any of the, um, that's a lie. I saw the first Matrix movie two years ago because I had to watch it for a college class. I'd never seen it before. I had to watch it for a class, and I was like, wow, this is really good. <gasps> Campsite visitor? Ew. Fairly Odd Parents was top tier. I agree. It was good. I took this amazing class in college that was like our lives on the internet, and it, we, we learned about like artificial intelligence and like all this stuff. We watched so many good movies. We watched The Matrix. You ever see that movie, Her? With um, Joaquin Phoenix and Scarlett Johansson? That movie is cuckoo, but also amazing. I've seen it too many times. Can I admit I watched Fairly Odd Parents as a child? No, of course. Hey, as long as you watched it. What else did I have to watch? I had to watch Space Odyssey for that class, which was great, but way too long of a movie. I've also never seen Star Trek as well. I've never seen that as well. Do I still have gifts to give them? Yeah, I do. All right, let's do a nice little round of villager gifting. And uh, yeah. Let's do that. Oh, I forgot this is throwing me off without the shrubs being in bloom. We gotta time travel backwards at some point. Mm. I haven't seen Star Trek either, but I don't know very much. I feel like, I feel like people either like Star Wars or Star Trek, but not both. Is that true? Poncho, what are you doing in front of Naomi's house? See, his catchphrase is rut row raggy. Who asked me about Scooby-Doo? His catchphrase is rut row raggy. <laughs> you like both? Okay, fair enough. I've never seen either, so like, who am I to weigh in? 
Um, you know what space movie I have seen and I love? Wally. It's a good one. Um, no, I definitely like both Star Wars and Star Trek. I think most people like both. Really? I always thought there was like a divide between them. It might be. I'm from the Star Wars generation, but I only like Star Trek. Spicy. Spicy. I love Wally. Wally is such a good movie. All right. Ratatouille is my favorite, but Wally is up there. Wally is so good. People hated Wally when it came out, and I love it. People are like, it's so annoying that he doesn't talk that much. And I'm like, no, that is the charm. And he likes Hello Dolly. So, like, same. Same Wally. Good, great movie. Eep. Me and Alex always say that to each other. We're always like, eep. I haven't seen Wally or Ratatouille. The amount of times I've seen Ratatouille is too many. Okay, Chai, get up. <gasps> it's so good. Yeah, there's no dialogue in until like an hour. Yeah, I love that. And I love that so much. Because it's just so captivating. It's like you don't need... That's the point. That's the whole point. Oh, my trees are growing now. Yay. Um, Like, that's kind of the whole point. I, and I love that. And, and I love that. It's so good. It's so good. I love it. I want to watch it again. I love Ratatouille. Emil is so cute. Yes. I was so into the TikTok Ratatouille musical. It was so fun. I was like, this is such a fun, stupid thing. And I love it. And I love it. Ratatouille. Oh my god, I can't talk about Up. I don't want to talk about Up. I'm still emotionally damaged from Up. Okay, I've already gifted Dione, so we don't need to go see her. Welcome back. Oh, hi, Sky. Just what I'm looking for. Bestie. Sky, I want your picture. Bestie, I need your picture. I can't even talk about Up. The emotional trauma of Up? It's too much for me. It's gonna be a no for me. It's so good. It's so good, but I can't do it. I can't watch it. I have to, like, skip the whole beginning. It's so sad. <laughs> when I was little, I'd never watch new movies. It was just Tangled. Aww! I love Monsters, Inc. I think I saw some cus... Wait, what did you say? You think you saw some custom designs near Sky? What do you mean? Yes, there are. I haven't done that area yet. That's the one... The one, um... Did she give me... What did she give me? Yeah, that's in front of Lolly's house. I haven't, um... That's the only house I haven't done yet. That's gonna be the last thing I do. There's, like, some random window things. Yeah, the one time I watched up is enough, too. I agree. I agree. Yeah. No, I know it's there, but thank you, guys. I'm doing that area last because I gotta... I'm gonna fill in every other part of the island, and then that's where the rock garden is. So, I'll touch that up last. That will be last. Monsters University was cute, too. I was worried about them making, like, a sequel, or a prequel, rather. Finding Nemo. Great. Love it. I've never seen Never Ending Story. No. I only know it because the song. I only know it because of the song. Oh my god, Inside Out. My boyfriend is the hot dad from Inside Out. We always talk about that. He thinks that's funny too, by the way. He was, when we were, remember when we were talking about this and you guys were like, what does Alex look like? And I said, the hot dad from Inside Out. He was sitting outside this door and he thought that was so funny. He was like, people have said that before, that I look like the dad from Inside Out. I'm like, you do. You are the hot dad from Inside Out, but like younger. That's what my boyfriend looks like. Right, Dexter? That's what your dad looks like. Dexter was just still vibing back there. I love Inside Out, too. It's good. Oh, Emperor's New Groove. That was a good movie, too. That was a good movie. You forgot what he looks like? I'm happy to show you. Should we put him on the screen? Should we put me hot? No, I shouldn't type that in. Just type in dad from inside. out. He, that's my boyfriend. Except... He has a mustache, 
and Alex has like a full beard. This guy has a mustache and um, like a weak beard, but this is literally what my boyfriend looks like. I won't type in hot because bad things come up. They come up anyway. Don't look it up. Don't look it up. Don't look it up. Um, this guy. Oh my God, stop. These are such bad pictures. Wait, hold on, hold on. I'm putting it on the screen. Oh, wait, what? Oh, you forgot what Alex looks like? Well, you got to see what Alex looks like. Because I showed you I showed you a picture. Don't tell him. Hey, Ray, Ray, welcome in. What's up? Oh, I'm going to have to take the Yaks off alive image. Hold on. I hope you guys enjoyed the Yaks while we had them. Okay, hold on. Where is the live image? That's the dad from Inside Out. So now imagine this man. But instead of this mustache, it's a beard. It's like a even beard. That is what my boyfriend looks like. The dad from Inside Out. The dad from, that's him. That's my boyfriend. Right there. Anyway, I loved both Goofy movies. Both Goofy movies. I think I like the one where he's in college slightly better than the other one, but I like them both. I like them both. He's cute. Uh, tell me he's not cute. Any and all Goofy movies. I like them all. I think I've just seen the one where he's in college more. Uh, you've slept all day. <laughs> Love that for you. Love that for you. Love that for you, my friend. I love seeing Doc in this house now. I love it. This one's my favorite one. I have seen Encanto. I have not seen Turning Red. But I really like Encanto. Right, Dexter? Dexter likes it, too. Dexter likes it, too. Give me your picture. What if you gave me your picture? Dexter. Hi. Hi. Oh, he's running. He's running. I was like, Dexter, as soon as I move this chair, he runs. He was here to lick my ankles, and I fully just deterred him. He said, never mind. No thanks. No thanks. Okay, Doc, give me a picture. Lame. Wait, why do they not like Encanto? It's so good. Oh, he's coming back. He's approaching. Aw, he just wanted to lay right behind my chair. Baby. Baby dog. That's just my baby dog. That's just my baby dog. Is Blue Bear home? Oh, she's right there. I love Hercules and Moana. They're both so good. They're so good. I've only seen Moana once, though. I should see it more. It's such a good one. It's a good one. Blue Bear, you want to give me your photo, bestie? Someone's got to give me their picture in this stream. Someone's got to. My one friend hates it. I don't know why. She just says it was dumb. And I'm like, what's wrong with you? Yeah. They are very emotional songs. Hercules is a good one. Do I have a favorite Disney princess? Oof. I don't know. Rapunzel? Maybe? It used to be Pocahontas. It isn't anymore. <laughs> It's not anymore. We, we don't talk about Pocahontas anymore. Not on this channel. I get too heated about Pocahontas. Can't I love Mulan, though. Yes, I love Mulan, too. See? We're on the same page. Love Mulan. Um, but I... I, I kind of hate Beauty and the Beast. I'm like, which one do I look like? Probably Belle. I don't really like Beauty and the Beast. Never have liked it. I think it is just... I think he's a mean, I feel like he, like, I don't like the beast. I don't like any part of him. I think it's Stockholm Syndrome. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I played Belle in a musical one. I don't like it. I don't like it. I've never seen Brave. I've never seen Brave. Oh, not this man. Not this man. The songs are good in Beauty and the Beast. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm sorry. No, I don't need to sing. <laughs> I'm more of a queen. Love it. Yeah. 
Rapunzel's probably my favorite. Oh. I mean, I like Ariel, too. I don't like it. Like, I don't like any... I don't... I'm sorry. I don't like Beauty and the Beast. I'm so sorry. I'm so, so sorry. Oh, yes. I love Princess and the Frog. I love Princess and the Frog, too. It's a good one. I love Beauty and the Beast as a kid, but as an adult, there's so many things wrong with it. Yeah, that's... I guess maybe I'm just thinking about it too much, but I'm like... Who said this was okay? Who said this was okay? I guess I'm inclined to say Cinderella too, because I like I like played Cinderella. So I'm like, I guess I should say Cinderella. She's like not my favorite. Um Sleeping Beauty's great too. Except she sleeps the whole time. She kinda sleeps the whole time. Um Listen, she's no Mulan. Mulan, like, saves an entire country. Mulan literally saves an entire country. So, she's winning, right? So, what does Snow White do? Snow White does nothing. Snow White's so bad. Um, <laughs> hot take. Does anyone else think... I See, I really liked Frozen when it came out. I think it's such a good story. But, yeah, I think it got crazy hype. Crazy. It's good, but, like, chill. But, like, chill. Mar, most fairy tales and Disney princesses based off of real things, but, like, in a horror kind of way, turned into a fairy tale? Yeah. Yeah. I don't like Snow White. Also, fun previous Disney cast member story. I was supposed to be friends with Hero from Big Hero 6 when the movie came out. <gasps> Literally dressed up as a teen and my voice cracking during the audition. Oh, no. I've never seen the second Frozen. Which I should, because it's, like, all Broadway people voicing everyone. Um, I liked it, but yeah, it got, like, so blown out of proportion. I feel like. I haven't seen this. I should watch the second one, though. Me and Alex kept saying that when it came out. We are like, we should probably watch the second Frozen movie at some point. We just never did. And I've never seen Big Hero 6. I've never seen it, but I've heard it's so good. I've heard it's really good. Did I already go see if Naomi was home? Did I do this? Yeah, I did. She's not home. I like Tinkerbell. Is Mulan really a princess? No, and neither is uh, Pocahontas. Neither is she. We call her princess for some reason. She's a princess in our heart. Don't get me started. Pocahontas makes me upset. I can't talk about it. I can't talk about it anymore. I got too upset last time. She does. She does. She deserves queen status. All right. Well, I didn't see Naomi and I didn't see someone else. Tinkerbell is rude, but I don't care. In her own movies, she's nice. In the Tinkerbell movies, she's a sweetheart. Isn't she? Is someone sitting here? Wait. No. Okay. Well, let's go decorate the next beach then. Let's go decorate the other side of the beach. Then we'll do another house. Lion King 2. I definitely have seen it, but I don't remember what happened. Well, quote unquote Disney princess is a title bestowed on Disney characters. That's why Anna and Elsa. Yeah. Isn't the girl from freaking Wreck-It Ralph considered a princess now too? The little girl, the candy lady, Vanellope. Isn't she considered a princess as well now? Good for her. I never saw the second one. I only saw the first Wreck-It Ralph. Which was good. But I didn't see the second one. So everybody's a princess. Can I be a princess then? I'm a princess then too. I should see Brave. I, I've never seen it. Isn't it like... Her family turns into a bear? Like what? What happened there? The Tinkerbell movies were so good. Did you guys play on pixiehollow.com? Because I looked for years to see if it was ever going to come back. This is going to be a tight area. I don't think I can do my starry night path. Yeah, why does her mom turn into a bear? That's weird. It's a little strange. Why does everyone got to turn into stuff? Why do we all need to turn into things? Brave is so good. I should watch it. I should watch it. Right after I watched Star Wars and the Lego movie. 
after I watch Star Wars and Lego movie, I'll get right on it. Um, I'm trying to think if there's a Disney movie I don't like. We've already talked about the emotional damage, why I can't watch The Fox and the Hound. We've talked about that one. I'm trying- Oh, I was just thinking about how to train your dragon, because I guess, like, Brave kind of gives me similar vibes to that movie. Um, I think I've only seen the first one. No, I think I saw the first two, but I liked them. I liked them a lot. I think Alex liked them a lot, too. I have to ask him. Speaking of DreamWorks, Jay's like Madagascar a lot. I was like such a Madagascar fan. Your cat is too- Oh, Mary Poppins! See, I liked Mary Poppins. I feel like- I feel like my mom didn't put that one on for me to watch as much. I feel like, why not? Because I feel like that would have been my favorite. I feel like that would have been my favorite one. I feel like my mom put on Toy Story and- <gasps> Madagascar was trash?! What's wrong with Madagascar? What do you- you didn't like the penguins? What's wrong with Madagascar? Oh, hi Faith, welcome in! Your cat is toothless. Toothless is so- Tell me Dexter is not toothless, kind of. Yeah, Julie Andrews, amazing. I also didn't grow up watching, like, The Sound of Music either. Like, why not? Baby Peyton would have loved that. Baby Peyton did watch a lot of Hello Dolly, though. Because that was the first movie that my mom saw. It was like playing in the hospital when I was born. So my mom was like, what if my daughter likes theater? Little did she know. Little did she know. Little did she know. Here I am. I've only seen The Sound of Music like twice. I know all of the songs. Okay, I know I've seen Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, but I have zero recollection of it. People say the Hello Dolly movie is trash, and I have to say they're wrong. Is it as good as the Funny Girl movie? No. No. But oh well. Oh well. I know I've seen it, but I don't remember it. Because we used to have, like, the collection of the VHS tapes, and we definitely had every single movie. Like, every Disney movie, but I just don't remember a lot of them. Okay, but I've never seen Singing in the Rain, so how dare I? How dare I? Obviously, I know the songs, and I know what it is. <gasps> Thank you, Bryson! Thank you so much! The paths are in the description. What's wrong with the- wait, what's wrong with Madagascar? You didn't like Madagascar? You didn't like it? Why not? Why not? You don't like Ben Stiller? You guys ever see Night at the Museum? Night at the Museum was like my favorite movie. Night at the Museum slapped. Can you make a poll without looking it up? Do you know what a VHS? Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. We, my mom still, my, if my mom sold her VHS collection, she would probably make millions. Okay. Based off of how the Titanic poll went, I think I know how this is going to go. I can quote singing in the rain from beginning to end, also White Christmas, which I've also never seen. What is wrong with me? I've also never seen Miracle on 34th Street. How dare. Night at the Museum, so good. That movie had no business being that good. I loved that movie so much as a kid. I watched it so many times. So many times. Okay, most of you say yes. Most of you say yes. There was more than one and two sequels? There was more than one and two sequels of uh, Madagascar? How many did they make? How many did they make? I know what VHS is, but I still haven't seen Titanic. It's two VHS tapes, because it's that long. You know what's the longest movie ever? You guys ever see Gone with the Wind? Gone with the Wind is a four-hour movie. Gone with the Wind is like five VHS tapes. They did come out with a Madagascar show. That and Barnyard are like the same energy for me, and you guys know how I feel about Barnyard. I love Barnyard, but I, that boy from Barnyard ruined the whole show. You know what I mean? 
Okay, this is oh, I miss Blockbuster. I lived right next to one. It was so good. VHS was my third parent, same. I would just, except it was always so annoying when you had to rewind them. Ugh, it's the worst. <gasps> yes, I love, we always just call them Dum Dum. One of my favorite characters in Night at the Museum, the best. So good. Then, uh, then Disney came out with The Wild. I've never seen that. Oh, I've never seen that. I rewound my VHS tapes before. Oh, before I return them to the library like a civilized person. You're so good. Yeah, Gone with the Wind literally has an intermission. It literally has an intermission. And it's not even, isn't there not even the windless storm until the second half? I don't even remember. I don't even remember. It was a four hour movie. It was too long, guys. Home on the Range is a good movie. I vaguely remember it. Hey, John, what's up? I've been listening for a while. My phone's behind the charger. No worries. Welcome in. Hope, you, hope you're doing good. What's up, what's up? I don't remember what the heck I'm looking for. Oh, like my star item. It's a long movie. It's like a really long movie. Okay, it's like, I get it, but like, wow. What's the longest movie you guys have ever seen? Other than like a movie that's in like five parts, right? Other than a movie that's like Breaking Dawn part one and two. You know what I mean? Like, what's the longest movie? Going to make a whole HHP house with my eyes closed? Oh my god. <gasps> Good luck. I've never seen The Green Mile. That's another one I've never seen. How dare I? I have never, wait, Chicken Run. I've seen Chicken Run. At first I thought of Chicken Little, which I've seen more. I've seen more of, but I do know Chicken Run. Yeah, you'll never get that time back. Literally, you'll never get that time back. L like when, that's too long. Are the Lord of the Rings movies really long? Are the Narnia movies long? I think I remember seeing a couple of the Narnia movies and they were, they're very long. Some of the Twilight movies were really long. I liked Chicken Run, but didn't do well at the box office. Isn't Chick Chicken Run is the same animation team as Wallace and Gromit, right? I'm thinking of the correct movie. Because I saw, like, all the, the Wallace and Gromit things. It's the same thing, isn't it? It's the same thing. Narnia is long, right? Okay, I'm, I'm thinking of the same thing. Okay. I'm thinking the same thing. I'm right. I loved those. I did love those. Yeah, I, I loved Claymation. I always really liked it. Lion, the Witch, and the Ro Wardrobe is a three-hour run. That's a long time. That's longer than a Broadway musical. That's longer than a musical. Okay. It's funny. You guys, so you guys, some of you know, I do work, uh, I do work customer service for Broadway shows. And a lot of the questions we get is someone asking, like, the run time of the show. And um, there's one show on Broadway right now with Billy Crystal. It's called Mr. Saturday Night. And the runtime is two hours and 45 minutes. And it happens to be a show that, I mean, like, all people could see, but a lot of, like, the Billy Crystal fans tend to be, like, older people. And um, they always are like, two hours and 45 minutes? That's insane! And I'm like, okay, is it? Titanic's, like, a three-hour movie, so, like... Is it that long? Is it really? Thank you guys. Keep that chat moving. Keep that chat moving. Keep them moving. What do you guys think was like, is it like a decent length of a Broadway show? What's a decent length? I feel like that two hours and 45 minutes isn't that long. Maybe I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. You know what the longest Broadway show ever is? How long is Into the Woods? Is Into the Woods not four hours long? It is Into the Woods not four hours long? It's four hours long. So funny. But, so my boyfriend knows nothing about theater. He Not that he doesn't like it, but he definitely, it's the only three hours, it feels like five. <laughs> I love it. 
it's so funny so alex knows like nothing he's not a broadway fan he's not a broadway stan like me but he respects that i like it he told me that when to the when the into the woods movie came out with like meryl streep and all of those people it was way before him and i knew each other when we were literally children um he told me he went to go see that movie I don't remember why he went to go see it, but he didn't, th his whole family went, they didn't know it was a musical, and he was so, he was like, I still have nightmares about that movie, because it's the longest movie ever, and it's all singing, and I was like, how did you not know, how did you just walk into, into the woods, and not know that they were gonna sing the whole time? And he was like, I had no idea. It was too much. And I was like, sir. <laughs> That's like if you walked into Les Mis and you were like, oh my god, they sing? I'm like, S yes, sir. Yes, my love. It's long, though. It is long. I will say that. Do you like the song, It's My Party? Is that the one that's like, it's my party and I cry if I wanna... I love Into the Woods. I want to see the new one, the Encores production that is coming to Broadway. What theater is it going to? Is there a chance I will get tickets to it? I don't think so. I don't think so. Wait, why did Nightbot delete that? I don't know why Nightbot deleted your comment, Kay. I'm sorry. <laughs> Nightbot is coming after you for no reason. The bots are ruthless. Yeah, they really are. I don't know. Nightbot is freaking out too now. Okay, to be honest, that was me with The Greatest Showman though. Wait, what? You didn't know they were going to sing? In the They don't sing that much in The Greatest Showman. Oh, the B word. Oh. 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 We have to add the word casino into the blocked words now, I guess. That's a new one. I've never seen that one till today. I've never seen that until today. Um. Anyway, um. Yeah, I want to see the new the the new production of Into the Woods. It looks so good. Except I'm chronically ill, and it's really hard for me to sit through the Broadway shows still because I'm in so much pain the whole time. So I haven't gotten to see that much, but hopefully soon I'll see another show. Yeah. Yes, they are. They are self-hating. Nightbot has some issues they gotta work through. I had no idea The Greatest Showman was a musical. It's, okay, that I almost understand because you would see like Zac Efron and you'd be like, oh my God, or like Zendaya and all these people. And you'd be like, okay, what is this like random movie? But you're walking in the lame is and you don't know it's like, you know, like, and Into the Woods. I was like, how did you not know? He was like, I had no idea. <laughs> that's like walking in, that's like putting on the Hamilton pro shot and being like, oh my God, they sing. Someone wrote into my job once. Again, customer service to Broadway. Um, and they complained that they went to see Hamilton and they were like, I took my, my seven year old daughter to come see Hamilton and I didn't know they were gonna rap the whole time and I want my money back because I didn't know they were gonna rap the whole time and I didn't like it. And I was like, what did you think was gonna, what? I'm sorry, what? That was one of my favorite things I've ever heard. I'm like, I'm like, first of all, I'm not giving you money. <laughs> I'm not giving you your money back for that. Um. But she was like, yeah, my seven year old was crying the whole time because she didn't like the rapping. Oh, I'm like, uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> what? If you Googled one thing about Hamilton, one thing, you listen to one song, you know what you're getting yourself. Also, they don't rap the whole time, first of all. There are times they don't rap. But like, I can't get this path to work here. This isn't working for me. Not working for me. I couldn't believe that. That was one of the craziest things. I was like, I, I don't know. Maybe you, sh maybe you should have went like to see the Lion King. I, I don't know. 
who am I to tell you what show to go see? They don't even rap the whole time. They, like, don't even. Okay, so maybe she didn't understand what was going on in Guns and Ships. Okay. I, is your seven-year-old gonna understand what's happening anyway, though? Like, you know? <laughs> I want a refund for my subpar parenting. <laughs> maybe make a right, a right side, then a top corner piece. Okay, wait, yeah. I love The Lion King. I, I saw it, I've only seen it once, but it's just such a good one. It's a good show. I don't know. Why are they taking their child to Hamilton? I don't know. Okay, when's coming in the day, for sure. <laughs> but I can't say that, though, because I'll get fired then. I can't say that. <laughs> oh, no. Same thing with six. A lot of people take their kids to see six, and I'm like, you can. But is your, like, four-year-old gonna understand what's happening with the six wives of Henry VIII? I don't know. I don't really know. But, like, sh if you wanna. <gasps> Thank you, Koi. That helped. Hello, people are so out of control. Like, yeah. I'm like... Okay, is The Lion King even a good decision? The Lion... Okay, here's the thing about The Lion King, though. Like, I know my cousin saw The Lion King when they were little, and they were terrified of it. Because the an spoiler alert for the Broadway production that's existed forever, the animals come down the aisle um, in the first, like, song of the show. So, it can be overwhelming. Um, but, I don't know. I think, what's cool about The Lion King, though, is The Lion King is very, very cool and, like, very um, accessible friendly. Like, I, I think they are the only show on Broadway that does um, sensory friendly performances. So they have specific performance dates where um, it's welcome for people with sensory issues as well as like people with autism that may not be able to um, see the show when there are some of the like other effects that go on. So they like they tone all of that down and they make it a totally like sensory friendly performance where people can get up and move around if they need to like they don't need to be confined to their theater seat like you might normally need to be they can like make noise and like I think that's so great I think every Broadway show needs to do that because it's um a lot of times like people will ask me about other shows and they'll be like hey where can my child sit like they they are not gonna be able to sit still the whole time and they're gonna need to get up and you know normally I'll have to like help them find specific seats that might be good for that but wouldn't that be nice if we just had full performances where that was accessible for everybody? I think so. I think so. I think so. The movie taught Everly to say, if you ever come back, we'll kill ya. <laughs> so I'm bitter about the Lion King. It does talk about death a lot. It's sad. It's, it's very sad, too. It's very sad. I think that was the one we probably watched the most growing up. I think it was my brother's favorite, so we always had it on. But yeah, it's very dark. It's very dark. Uh, peop they can go see Aladdin. Aladdin is good for kids. Except I'm sad um, Abu is not in the Broadway production. I'm kind of sad about that. About No, I tell people are like, is Beetlejuice good for kids? And I'm like, no. No, it's, it is not. It's so fun. Don't bring your five-year-old. Don't bring your five-year-old. No. There is not a K-pop Broadway show, but that would be cool if there was. I took my daughter to see Wicked. Really? <gasps> Wicked was my first Broadway show. I loved Wicked. Wicked is good. Not if you're five. I feel like if you're like eight though, it's good. If not, it's probably scary. I remember even at eight, I was like a little scared of the flying monkeys. Oh, I could end this poll, huh? Um, you probably don't understand what's going on though, if you're a kid. There's like a lot of plot. There's a lot of plot in Wicked. It's very plot heavy. It's great. It's very plot heavy. Wicked was my first show. It was my, it's my mom's favorite Broadway show. So it was the first one she took me to. I was eight. And then I saw Phantom of the Opera next, which I did not understand, but I enjoyed it and then became obsessed with it. 
I didn't understand the plot of Phantom until I was like 15 though. And I had to like rewatch it. And I was like, oh. I didn't know any of this happened. Oh, I have these cushions as well. Wicked was my first Broadway show too. Oh, I love Kinky Boots. <gasps> my, I saw, I saw Kinky Boots twice. Kinky Boots is my mom's second favorite Broadway show. She loves it so much. We saw Kinky Boots, I think we saw it opening weekend. You hate Phantom. Phantom is so messed up. It's so messed up, but I also love it. I also love it, but like, who let this happen? Who let this happen? I love, yeah, I love Little Branches. I love Taya. Taya's great. Um, okay, I, I, listen, I was, I had such an unhealthy obsession. I, I had such an unhealthy obsession with Phantom of the Opera. You mostly hate it because, because it's not opera. Because I know you are, you are a talented vocalist, okay? It's not an opera. It's something. Okay, so I agree. Listen, the songs are great. The plot is weird. Why was I idealizing the Phantom? Why did I, why was I in love with him? You sing opera? I love Phantom. Oh my God, can you sing the ending notes of Phantom of the Opera? Can you do that? Oh, can you do that? Probably get that all the time. <laughs> oh my God, I love opera. People probably, people probably ask you about Les Mis too. It's just not opera at all. Nailed it. <laughs> can you sing, can, do you want to be Christine Daae? Is Christine Daae your dream role? Because you pitied him, yeah. Yeah, but he's such a bad person. It's only because, okay, I watched the 25th anniversary special on repeat, and I, I, Ramin Karamlu is too attractive, okay? I was, like, justifying all kinds of problematic behavior. Oof, lame is, I can't with that because, of, wait, what, you don't, you don't like, you don't like One Day More? Did you hear me singing it last night? I was trying to sing all of lame is as Hugh Jackman last night. So I was like, what did I keep singing last night? I kept trying to sing everything as Hugh Jackman last night. Too many people singing. I like it when they overlap everybody singing. I like that. It's a, it's a lot, but like, it's good. It's good. I like it. My first musical was Blood Brothers. I loved it. It's vague now. I've heard of that, but I've actually never seen it. But that's cool that your first musical wasn't one that was like super cuckoo. He's so toxic. Love Never Dies is so much worse. Why did Love Never Dies need to be created? What, who did that? Who did that? Can't do it, wanna focus on one storyline at a time. I guess that's a good point. Uh, Fontaine dies too fast. You know, cause then after she dies, I'm like, okay. That was too quick. It's too quick. And now I'm like, oh, I guess I care about Epony and oops, she's dead too. Spoiler alert for Les Mis, I guess. <laughs> uh, and then I don't really care about Cosette and Marius. TBH. Spoilers. Oopsies. Oopsies. Does anyone care about Cosette and Marius? Does anyone care? No, no one cares. Listen, I think Eponine should have tried to go after Angerus anyway, because Aaron Tveit was better. Oh, do you hear the music outside? Oh, I've never seen Miss Saigon. I know like the famous songs. I know the, the helicopter. I've never actually seen it though. I wish I got to see that most recent revival though. I heard it was so good. It's been out long enough. If you haven't seen Les Mis at this point, I'm so sorry I spoiled it. You're not gonna watch it. If you haven't already seen it, when are you watching it? You're not gonna watch it at this point then. You know the whole soundtrack and I've never seen Miss Saigon? That's me with a couple musicals. I'm like, I know every song, but have I ever seen it? No. I've never seen My Fair Lady. I'm like, I know the songs. I Same thing with like, um like South Pacific. Okay, like same thing with Evita. I've never seen Evita either. Pra grandparents would always take you to see Evita. Interesting. Has anyone seen Millennium Actress? I don't know that. No, what's that? What's that? No. What is this? 
Oh yeah, which cast recording? London or Broadway? Is there a villager dis I dislike so much? Moose. I hate Moose. Moose is the worst. Moose is my least favorite villager in the game. I don't want to see that man. I want to look at him. Love Never Dies is the official thing. Okay, okay, all right. If you uh, have any interest in Love Never Dies, aka the sequel of Phantom of the Opera, you don't want it to get spoiled, mute this right now. Okay, okay, so they wanted to make a sequel of Phantom of the Opera to get Phantom and Christine together. Sure, fine. Why kill her then? Why kill her off? Why? Why did that need to happen? Why make Meg a psychopath? Why did that need to happen? Why did that Also, poor Rao. I don't like Rao. But also, yikes. Yikes. I've never see I've never seen Aida either, but I love the music. So good. Why did they need to kill her off? What was the point? What's the point? And now one song in Love Never Dies that's like so spicy about like when they got together. I didn't need that. I didn't need it. I didn't need it. I didn't need it. It was a lot. It was a lot, guys. Mm? Drama. It was a lot. Mm? Only good song is uh, Till I Hear You Sing. It's good. It's all right. Wait, we did a cold read as an exercise in school. Wait, with what? With Love Never Dies? Wait, no, I'm old. I listened to the OG cast. No, the OG. Yeah. I think that's probably what I would have listened to either. Rao is problematic, too. I don't like Rowl either. I don't like either of them. My mom did walk down the aisle to All I Ask of You, though, which I think is very sweet. Oh, no, Aida. Yeah. In dance class, when I was a child, we did a dance to My Strongest Suit, and that is how I got into it. I also really liked Adam Pascal, because I always really liked Rent, so... It's pretty cute. <laughs> Wait, what's pretty cute? I'm scared. What did I just say? <laughs> what did I say? Oh, that we did a dance to it? It was cute. We did one for Legally Blonde, too. I was a greeter for Love Never Dies back in Orlando. Oh, yes. I think you told me that. Yeah. Uh, who did that? Why is it, like, weird Coney Island music, too? Oh, the All I Ask of You? Yeah. Isn't that beautiful? It's, it's beautiful. She, when she told me, and she doesn't even really like Phantom that much. So I was surprised. It's, it's a good Broadway love song, okay? I got a Broadway love song playlist. It's a good one. It's a good Broadway love song. Gotta make lunch for my kiddos. No worries. Enjoy lunch with the kiddos. Back from shopping. Got 20 buck gift card. Nice. Oops. Oops. Oops, oops, oops. Okay, um, we're gonna do another villager house now. I don't know which one. Hey, Peyton. Nothing better <laughs> than to wake up to a stream and you're talking about Phantom. Thank you. Thank you, Sage. You know what? I'm here to deliver the content. Wait, weren't you sitting before? Here, take my present. Give me your picture. We see Naomi too. Gonna head out, Peyton. Have fun with the rest of the stream. Thank you so much for being here, Annabelle. So much love to you, my friend. All the love, all the love. Some apples. Yum. Did you guys grow up with, like, movie musicals, too? Did you guys watch, like, Hairspray and Grease? You like Hairspray? You like Grease? You like all those? Like Footloose? All those things? I think that I was obsessed with Zac Efron and Hairspray so much as a kid. Too much. It's fine. Ooh, maybe Chai's house is next. <gasps> I've never seen it! Can you believe I've never seen that either? I've never seen School of Rock. We might do Chai's. I think actually let's do Chai's house. I think that'll be nice next. Talking to them for the first in the day. Yes, I did know that. Gives you bonus points. Love your island. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Dexter is still vibing back there, right? Yeah, he is. He's vibing. He's vibing. We're good. We good.
All right, Tom Nook. I think I'm gonna do Chai's. I've never seen Scott Pilgrim either. I'm so sorry. It counts, there's music in that. That's like, um, anything. Anything with music counts. I'd say so. Moulin Rouge counts. I've never seen it, unfortunately. Welcome back, Modern Chatter. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing good. Um, I think we're gonna do chai. I know, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What's wrong with me? What's wrong with me? I gotta see all the movies. I'm so sorry. Oh, she's wearing my taxi cab dress. I love that. I love Chicago. Roxy Hart, man. If I could dance. If I could dance, I'd be unstoppable. If I could dance, I would be un. I can't not dance. I can dance. Not now, right now, as I'm still chronically ill and cute, but like, I can. Can. I don't think I'm, I don't think I'm gonna change her exterior, but let's take a look at it. Probably not. Cats, the first movie, not the new one. I've never seen the original Cats either. My mom always told, my mom hates it. Um, do I know who was, was Pamela Anderson Roxy when you were here? Still? Was Pamela Anderson still Roxy? Now it is the girl who won that contest. The, like the search for Roxy Hart contest. It's her now, but she just started like yesterday. Was Pamela Anderson Roxy when you were here? Or did you just miss her? She is! Oh wait, she still is? No, that new girl started. But she just has a limited run, I think. I can't. I saw Billy Ray Cyrus in Chicago as Billy Flynn. I saw Billy Ray Cyrus. Yellow roof? I like the yellow roof. Yellow roof is cute. He was so bad. He was so bad. It was bad. It was, yeah. That story was a lot. Oh, look at Dexter. Look at him. Look at that man. He's vibing. He's hanging out. Yes. Billy Achy Breaky Heart. Yeah, Cyrus. Yeah. Yeah. He was, oh my god. It was something. It was fun because I was such a huge fan of um, Miley Cyrus. Oh boy. Cutie, right? Isn't he a cutie? Dexter has no business being this cute. No business. Zero. Um, they've had a lot of crazy celebrities in Chicago. I cannot believe. Every time they announce a new person that's in it, and I'm like, you know what? That makes sense. Hey, that makes sense. We're gonna give her Starry Night too. Billy Ray Cyrus in Chicago feels like something from a parallel universe. It was. It really was. And it was my first time seeing it. I was young. I was like a child. Okay. Um. I'm trying to think. What's different? Me trying to use the exact same wallpaper in every single house, but then trying to make it different. I feel like I would be remiss if I didn't use her cinnamon roll stuff, but I kind of don't want to. I kind of don't want to. What if I don't? Who's going to stop me? Mm. I don't know if I like that. Ooh. Ooh. Maybe that one. Can you give me two random numbers? One of the numbers has to be four or less. Uh, four and eight. Let's go back to work. Have fun. See you. Much love, my friend. Have a great rest of your day slash night. When I saw Miss Saigon back in 2017, I was fangirling because some of the actors, yes, were like celebrities back in the Philippines. I love that. I love that. Need more, we need more representation. I can't talk. Filipino representation. Gosh, people. This is like green. This is not blue. I kind of like this for chai though. It kind of feels very teacuppy. Kind of feels a little teacuppy for me. 
I think we're gonna do the marble again. I did the marble for Chai, but I think I'm gonna do it again. Oh no. Oh no. Uh oh. Wait, when was this? Oh, this was like 10 minutes ago. <gasps> oh, I got the Sabotage League new rules and I got a DM from Crunchy. I got a DM. Uh oh, it's gonna happen. Ah, it's gonna happen. Dexter is so cute. I agree. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm gonna have to take a nice little peek at that later. Nice little peek at that later. Oh, no. It's all real. It's all happening. Actually, I don't know if I like this. Because I don't like this having, like, bl black at the bottom. I think that's what I don't like. Maybe I do change it to this one. I check my uh, messages after this. I check some messages after this, I guess. I have no idea what I want here for this one. I don't know. I definitely need to do a kitchen for chai. I don't know, maybe here in this corner? Maybe here in this corner? We'll do it. Let's see. I think that I wanna do, uh-oh, I know, I gotta look, I gotta look. I wanna look now, but I can't look now. Is it happening this week? Am I gonna have to do this this week? Cause Crunchy sent me a DM, it's like, let me know your schedule. And I was like, oh, I gotta look at it. I am scared. Is the gold worth a million points now? If, if the gold is worth a million points, I... I'm scared. I'm so scared. I mean, me? Not scared at all. I'm gonna win. Not scared at all. Mm-mm. I do know what Five Nights at Freddy's is, but I've never played it. I've never played it. I'm passing all my kitchen items, hold on. I haven't looked yet. I'm half trying to learn stuff for rehearsal tonight. I'm scared of this music. Oh, I'm sending you good vibes. I'm sending you good vibes. I might look at it. I might look at it. What if I looked at it? What if I just look at it? What if I look at it right now? I just look at my messages really quick. See what I missed? You guys get the exclusive tea, I guess. You guys get the exclusive tea as I turn this on. Round two player sabotages have been updated. Villager points have been updated and the rules have changed. Updates to the rules. You can now exchange two points from your score to spin the wheel again. <gasps> what? <coughs> what? Wait, wait, wait. Okay, hold on. Let's read this. Let's take a moment to talk about this. Okay, around two players. Sabotages have been updated. I'll, I'm not going to read those out loud to you, but I will take a look at them. Updates to the rules. You can now exchange two points from your score to spin the wheel again if you don't like the sabotage you got. Okay, so if I get that sabotage, that's like, guess on every five tickets which, which villager it is. Skipping that one. Easy. Also, option B <gasps> has changed from 15 points for gold nuggets to 25. Oh, feel free to schedule times with your new opponent. Oh my god, okay. Hold on, I gotta look at this. Oh, I'm so skipping the five ticket test. So skipping it. Huh, that's interesting. Because if they can just skip... Can you just skip all of the sabotages then? If you can just skip all of this, you say I'll take, the, I'll take minus two points, I'll skip every sabotage, then maybe it's worth going for the gold. 25 points. Wow. Okay, let's find, oh my God. Oh my God, these scores. Point systems for villagers, horses, five points, monkeys, and gorillas. What? What is this? 
What is this? Okay, point system for villagers. Horses, five points. Monkeys, two points. Gorillas, two points. Kangaroos, two points. Frogs, dogs, pigs, zero. Penguins, five. All other villagers, one. What? Oh my god. Bring on the penguins, I guess. Bring on the penguins. Okay, hold on. Hold on, I'm looking at my sabotages too. I won't read them out to you. Oh, he for sure did that one because of me. I can't, I can't. Okay, wait. What the heck? No, these are so bad. Oh my God, these are so bad. These are so bad. These are so bad. Oh my God. These are a million times worse than last round. Oh, I'm skipping all of them. And this is just the ones on my list for him. I have no idea what's on his list. These are bad. These are so bad. Oh my God. Okay, well, um, wow, we've got some thinking to do. We've got some thinking to do. Wait, Kay. Kay, you let me know if you're on team A. Kay, what if we make an alliance? Kay, we make an alliance? If you're on the different side than I am, I'm in B. If you're in A, what if you leak your sabotages to me? Is that against the rules? Wait, is that against the rules? I'll leak, I'll leak the team B sabotages to you. Pat knows them all. Is that against the rules? Are you A or B? Are you A or B, K? Are you A or B? I'm curious. Because I'm on B. Do we form an alliance? <laughs> Some of these are nuts. Nuts. I... I wonder, I gotta ask some clarifying questions. If you get a sabotage and you don't like it, you get to skip and spin the wheel again. Can you keep doing that until you get ones you like? How many times can you do that? How many times can you do that? Can you do that the whole game? <gasps> I'm A, stop trying to tempt me. Okay, the ones on my list are so bad. That's, they're so bad. Yes, but you just keep losing the points. Yeah, but so, the ones on my list, I can't even imagine. Mm -mm. Is it cheating? Pat knows them all. He's competing. Is it cheating? I'm gonna ask him. I say, what if I form an alliance with someone on team A and they leak the sabotages to me? Can I do that? What if I did that? Listen, you gotta think smart, guys. Guys, you gotta think, you gotta think smart. How many points do you wanna sacrifice? Yikes. The sabotages are a million times worse. <gasps> Koi, thank you for the two. My box. Take your box. Take your box. It's your box for the taken. I think actually it might be cheating. Is it? How is it cheating? Because, okay, think about it this way. You're going up against Pat. Pat knows every possible sabotage already. He knows every possible sabotage, so why shouldn't you? Why shouldn't you? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Think about it like this. He knows, he knows every possible sabotage he could get from you. You have no idea. Just saying. Just saying. Miss Ma'am is too big brain. Listen, I see no rule against it. Will I ask him anyway? Yeah. <laughs> Like, will I get disqualified if I ask uh, Team A to send me their list? I'm gonna ask him. So I can mentally prepare? Yeah. <laughs> Gotta be aggressive. Listen, listen. I feel as though I am the underdog and I want to win. Oh my god, Amy, it would be my dream. That's, I, I feel like that I've achieved all of my Animal Crossing creator goals. That's the last one. That's the last one. 
If I got to be on LCS, I would cry. I would have, I couldn't believe it. I would cry. Not my Switch dying. Oh no. I feel like doing like these kitchens is always so hard because I wanna like make this like a full corner thing. Some LCS level strats. Listen, people already are counting me out. I'm not trying to get counted out of this thing. I'm not trying to get counted out. Listen, listen, listen. I'm not trying to get counted out. Mm -mm. I'm gonna have to think of a, I think I have several questions though. So I'm gonna have to ask him a couple things. Me and K in Alliance. K pay versus K. Pay versus K. That's what we want. That's what we want. Except it couldn't be us in the finale, which would stink because we're both on the same side of the bracket. Stinks. Stinks. Mm. I don't know what I want. I don't know what I want. Two plus two equals 22. You nailed it. You've nailed it. K and K. Uh, listen, I'm here for it. I'm here for it. I am here for it. I am here for it. I have to look at my schedule because today is my day off and tomorrow is my day off. Um, so <laughs> I am not mentally prepared to do this tomorrow. Maybe Saturday's stream if Crunchy's free. To be fair, the oh, the golden nugget thing, I have to think about it now. I have to conduct some tests now. I have to conduct some tests to see if it's way more tempting now. Way more tempting now. Because 15 before, there was no way you were gonna find the golden nugget in 15 tickets. So it's not even worth the 15 points. And you if you got that one sabotage that's like you lose two points for every for the five islands if you guess wrong imagine you spent all your time looking for the golden nugget just to get that sabotage and you lost all the points no but now i can skip that one that one's not on that one's not on here actually anymore i think i think that one is gone from my list at least i don't know nightmare i would cry oh my god i now the gold is that's what he did on purpose because he was like no one's doing the gold so i gotta make it spicier <gasps> stop pat um, pat i have quest actually can i ask you now pat um, i see nowhere in the rules what if i make an alliance with someone on team a because i'm on side b what if i make an alliance with someone and they leak their sabotage list is that against the rules because technically you know all of them and you're competing is that against the rules pat um, pat is that against the rules we literally just <laughs> How do you know I'm talking about this? Pat knows when I'm talking about this and just comes in. I swear I like do other things on this channel. I don't exclusively talk about this. I swear I do, I do other things. We did, we summoned him because I got too spicy. I was like, Peyton's trying to break the rules. <laughs> Listen, Pat's everywhere. Always lurking. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm nervous now. I'm nervous. I didn't see a single penguin last time. You think I'm gonna see penguins? I didn't see a single penguin last time. Peyton is full- Listen, listen. Everybody told me, they're like, Peyton, you're, this is cute, but you have no chance. Um, I mean, I guess you can leak them. Peyton, K. K. Bestie. K. I can help you. You send me your team A sabotage list, then you have an even playing field going into your match with Pat because Pat knows both sides. Pat knows both sides of this. Just let me know if you want to talk. If you want to talk after this, I'll send you my cute little list. These are dirty, Pat. These are dirty. I mean, I guess you can leave them hate known as your friend in this league. I don't know. Listen, I'm trying to make some strats. I'm just trying to make some moves. She's trying to make some moves. I'm not trying to get counted out of this thing. I'm not trying to get counted out. I'm here for the, okay. I'm DMing you after this. I'm DMing you after this. They're dirty. Can I just keep skipping them too? I, I mean, I know I'll lose a million points, but like if I hate every sabotage, can I just keep like, just keep taking that L? I just keep taking the loss until I like one. Cause, oh god, I can't even imagine. Like, some of these are so dirty. I'm like, absolutely not. 
Absolutely not. You can reroll, but you might get the same one. Oh, that's true. I gotta master the wheel. I gotta do some research about the gold nuggets now, too. You made it tempting now. I'm like, oh, yikes. Everybody's gonna do the nuggets now. Everybody's gonna do the nuggets, right? Am I? I don't know if I am. I don't know. I gotta think about it. I, can, I feel like Crunchy's gonna do the nuggets. Crunchy's chaotic enough to do the nuggets. As many rerolls as we want, but we lose two points every time. So. I gotta think about it. I gotta think about the strategy. I gotta think about it. Oh, it's juicy. 25 points? That's a lot. That's a lot. 25 points is a lot. That's a lot. It's a lot of points. But also, that's a lot of time to spend potentially looking for something that you're never going to find. You know? All right, mods, we're doing a voice call. We're going to have to talk about this. We're going to have to talk about this. <laughs> we're going to have to we're gonna have to strategize about this. Team Sloth is going to have to put on their thinking caps. I'm worried about the gold nugget and some sabotage stacking. Yeah. I, I kept thinking about that too. I'm like, I'm going to look for the... If I choose to look for that gold nugget, I'm going to be looking at the gold nugget and then Crunchy's going to hit me with every single sabotage while I'm still looking for it and it's going to be horrible and I'll never win. And then I'll never win. But then again, if I don't choose the gold nugget and Crunchy does and gets 25 points off the bat, I don't know if I could make that up. That's a lot of points to make up. That's a lot of points to make up. Especially when there's a lot more points available with the villagers. Yeah, that's that's true, too. That is true, too. It's not just you need a penguin and that's it. There's, like, lots of options. You have 30 minutes of safe time to find it. Yeah, but I'm not going to find it in 30 minutes. I know it's possible, but I don't know. That's such a big risk. It's such a big risk. I'm just worried if I don't take that risk and he does... Mods, we're gonna make a PowerPoint. Pro and con list. Hey, Ruth, welcome in. I hope you're doing good. I have not been paying attention. To, I hate this. I like hate all this right now. Hold on. Hold on. We're starting over. I'm starting over. Does she need a kitchen? No. Maybe she doesn't. Also, penguins are negative five. Wait, they're negative five? I thought they were plus five. Wait, what? Did I read that wrong? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Did I read this incorrectly? It's negative five points for a penguin. Oh my God. Oh my God, it's negative five points. I read that as five points. Okay, so horses are the ones we want. Horses are five points, monkeys, gorillas, and kangaroos. So you picked the ugly villagers for the points this time. Oh my God. Negative five points for a penguin. Frogs, dogs, pigs are zero, so we don't want to see those. Oh my god. I'm going to have to make up some songs about horses now. Yikes. Ro I better not. Scans in all penguins. Oh my god, yes. <gasps> oh my god. I better not see my boy roll. I don't think I saw that many last time. It's summer, so all the snowy boys are negative five. Yikes. I wonder why the pigs <laughs> I wonder why the pigs are zero. I think, okay, the pigs are zero, but if I find truffles, can I get 100 bonus points just because I had to deal with the ugliness? Just cause? Okay, I think I'm going to change my design here with this. I kind of hate what I'm doing. I'm distracted now. This happened the other day, too. I was, like, doing good. That's why I was trying to, like, not do all these villager interiors in a row because I get so sick of it, like, so fast. Um, it's not my fault if I have an all penguin island. It's not. It's not. You can do whatever you want. Listen, that's a, how many penguins are there? What is the probability of actually seeing a penguin anyway? I don't like any of this. I'm kind of like... It's top, it is top tier logic. Top tier logic, I can't do. 
I can't do. I'm just gonna go back to this one. <laughs> Can you make like, wait, <laughs> what? What sheep do you want to be 700 points? It would be a shame if I changed the minus five villager last minute. What are you gonna, oh. What's, what do you think is the worst species? I mean, gorilla, but you, you're giving us extra points for a gorilla. <gasps> there are 14 penguins? Oh my God. Okay, but that's kind of, is the nuggets worth it then? If I spend all of the time looking for the nuggets and then I see a bunch, I see five penguins. What's the point? What's the point? What's the point? What is the point? <laughs> oh my god. What is the point? That's too few penguins for my team. I like the penguins. I think they're all right. I think, um, what penguin hurt you, Pat? No, I'm gonna win. Mm -mm, don't count me out yet. Everyone's counting me out. Everyone's like, oh, Peyton, this was cute for you, but you have no chance. Uh-uh. You don't know me. You don't know me. Guys, I have an incurable chronic illness. I am in pain every day. You don't know how tough I am. You don't know how tough. You don't know. I'm going to do the eye black and I'm going to put orange glitter on it this time. I'm ready to fight. I'm ready to fight. Okay. It's definitely a tough decision. I think the worst thing is losing once. I, that's, that's, that for me is the biggest thing. But now it's more tempting because he can just skip the horrible sabotages. Endo warrior and cute. Maybe we can try and schedule it for um, Sunday, which is my endo anniversary. So maybe I'll have extra luck on my, maybe I'll have bad luck on my endo anniversary because I was in the ER a year ago. So maybe not on that day. Maybe not on that day. We'll see. I kind of want to put like the tables and chairs and I have not decorated this house at all. <laughs> I have done not a thing. Not a thing for Miss Chai. I believe in you. I have no idea what's happening, but you can do it. Thank you. I'm talking about Nintendox Sabotage League round two, which I weaseled my way into. And um, details to come after this stream when I try and schedule when I will be competing next. Also, big thing, do not let me... Do not let me sit like this. I could not move the whole weekend after the last stream. I was in so much pain. So do not let me do it. Wait, the table and chairs are so cute there. Thank you. I kind of think like this is nice. Like this is like her main vibe. Maybe the bed goes here. Maybe she doesn't need a full kitchen. I kind of hate a kitchen. I don't really care for a kitchen that much. You know? Uh, not everyone always obsessed with Ione. Then me not liking her, I just need, I like the tail. I love Ione. I think Ione's cool. Yeah, I need a posture command. I mean, sometimes I'm sitting the way I'm sitting because I'm already in pain. So I'm like, all right, I got to help myself out. But I know it's intense and I'm all for like the game and making it intense. I cannot put myself in that much pain again though. I couldn't move the whole weekend. Could not move the whole weekend, and that was not good for me. It's not good for me. Peyton's foster jack. Thank you. You all knew. Jen messaged me. Ray Ray messaged me. They were like, are you okay, Peyton? Like, I know that was probably a lot for you. And I was like, I'm in pain. But I got it. I'm tough. I'm tougher than I look. I'm tougher than I look. I'm tough. Me? She's tough. Um, I don't know what I want to do for this, though. I'm sad the frogs and the dogs are worth zero points. We can't do our frogs, dogs, coconuts. Frogs, dogs, coconuts. Frogs, dogs, coconuts. Yeah, like, can we schedule it, like, as soon as we want? Or... Is it happening this week? Are we waiting? My work schedule is crazy this week. I'll make it work, but it's gonna be cuckoo. 
not like any of those. I hate everything that I'm doing. Okay, that's fine. Um, okay, cool. Yes, you can schedule it as soon as you want. Okay. I gotta hope we have a similar schedule. I can't. Tomorrow is my day off, so I'm like, tomorrow night would be great, but I can't do it tomorrow night. I'm not mentally prepared. Also, my island's not done! I wanted to get my island done, because everything's gonna be horrible to navigate now. Mm. Let me think about it. My island's not done yet. Mm. I just ditched the villager interiors, say my island's done, flatten it tomorrow. I'm not gonna do that. Mm. Maybe I'll do that. No. No, no, no. Don't let me do that. Mm. I've worked too hard terraforming my map into the literal, literal starry night. Mm to speed run the end of it. The only day it doesn't work for me is Friday. I can't wait to see. Your guys' match is gonna be so good. I cannot wait. I can't wait. I feel like, what are the matchups? It's me and Crunchy. It is you and Kay. It is Snacks and Blaine. And Olive and Cora. Oh, they're all good. They're all good. I know, I have to kick out a villager again too, but I do have Sherb's photo. I have Ione's and Lolly's now at this point. So I got more options of people to kick out. Um, I will probably, after I finish this stream, speed run getting the villager photos even more because I'm gonna need them. I'm going to need them. Oh my God. I am going to stop doing the villager interiors now, after this one. Because now I also can't kick out someone whose house I've decorated. Which is literally just Ione. Literally Ione needs to move out and that's it. I think she had a thought bubble the other day though, so I think I can make that happen. Okay, whose houses haven't I done? I haven't done... I did most of them, guys. No. <gasps> oh, yikes. Okay. I haven't done ponchos yet. Poncho could be an option. He's going to give me his picture next. I could feel it. Okay. So if, after I finish this one, we're done with the villager houses today. Let's move on to finishing the exteriors and um, villager photos for the next hour that I'll be streaming. I And I did lollies already. Yikes. Who let me do this? Peyton, stupid. Ugh, I did, why did I do that? Why did I do that? I mean, I could finish it because I'm, tomorrow's stream is the island doesn't, ugh, I gotta think about it. I gotta think about it because tomorrow's stream is the stream doesn't end until I finish the island. So I could just speed run it all and finish it tomorrow or I could not. I could not. We'll have to see. Yikes. I got a lot to think about. Thank you. Keep the chat moving. Look at that fancy sloth. It's very fancy. It's very fancy. I think he's a very cute little sloth. And I love that for him. Um, I... I wish the sink was on this side. Cause like, it's kind of a hazard for the sink to be right here. Can't really get there. Is the, oh, is this one the opposite? It is. Oh, but it's not gonna match. Ew. Not gonna match. I mean, no, I hate that. Instant hate. Okay, she doesn't need a sink. Who does her, she doesn't need a sink. We're gonna put a fridge there and that is her kitchen. Cool. Cool. Do you need anything else other than a fridge and a stove? Fridge, a stove, and DoorDash. Do you need anything else? How about the sloppy sink? I don't think she's very sloppy. Do you think she's very sloppy, though? Do you think she's sloppy, though? I feel like she's got... I feel like Chai has it together. I feel like Chai has got it together. You know? I think we're gonna do this. 
A new emote? Oh, yes, the rainbow one. I made the rainbow one the other day. Not sloppy. I might think I'm just gonna do this. I think we're gonna do this. I'll put, like, teacups on this thing. Um, I don't know what else. Maybe, like, a cute little mirror moment makeup table thing. Oh, the hand washing sink is good, too. I'm just gonna leave it. I'm over it. And then I can't do these interiors anymore. We gotta move on. Um, I don't know when you were here last, but I'm doing Chai's interior at the moment. And, um... This is the last interior I'm gonna do on the stream. Cause I uh, didn't plan this very well. Didn't plan this out very well today. But that's okay, we've got plenty of other things we need to do. Plenty of other things we need to do to finish the island. It's okay. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be okay. It's all all right. Chill vibes. Welcome back, Ray Ray. Ray Ray, did you hear all of the chaos that ensued while you were gone? Did you hear all the chaos that ensued? Mods, we're doing a voice call. I'm gonna need to talk through some strategies. I'm gonna need to, there's more for me to actually strategize about, so I'm gonna need to talk through it. I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need to talk through it. I did not. Bestie, oh, get ready. Oh, get ready, bestie. There's a lot to talk about. There's a lot to talk about. Also, wait, when did we hit 121 likes? Thank you, guys. That's so nice. Hype, hype, hype. I don't know if that happened a while ago, but thank you. Hype, 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 hype. All the hype. Um... Peyton, you're a bestie and an OG. Can your bestie and OG help? I'm going to just do it with the mods because I don't want to spoil everything for anybody. But my mods have to get all the inside information anyway because they need to help me out. But tune in. It's going to be fun. 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 I think I'm going to put this here. And give me a little vanity. Give me a little makeup table. Me a little makeup table. Is Dexter still home? Dexter is still sleeping. Like, he is just... This man... Don't wake up. No, no, no. Stay there. He's still just, like, hanging. Are you just hanging out? Bestie. Look at that man. He's been such a good boy. He's just been hanging out in here with me all day. He's been chill. I mean, I forced him to be in here with me, but like, it's all good. You're a cute doggy, huh? He's so cute. He's got no business. He has zero business being that cute. Oh, that's way too big. He, that's exactly, 100%. He has like positioned himself so that the fan continues to hit him perfectly. For sure. Hi, Pink Popsicle. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. What's up? What's up? He's just... A baby. He's a little baby dog. And I love him. This is why he can't ever be in this room for Sabotage League. I get so distracted. I'm just like, but look at my dog. Look at my dog, guys. The whole time. This is Dexter's stream. It's not mine. It's fully Dexter's stream. Actually, let's do this. Um... I don't like that. Let me, like, put this in the middle. <laughs> Let me, like, uh, put that in the middle. Let me put that in the middle. Is this one skinnier? Can I put this here and then also put something here? No. That's not how it works, Peyton. That's not how it works. Chat check. I'm on live chat. Make sure you guys are on live chat. And not top chat, because then you'll miss stuff. You'll miss stuff, and that's not fun. It's not fun. Okay, um, that's gonna bother me so much. Ah, uh, that's gonna bother me so much. I'm gonna put a plant in front of that. Like, me, yeah, I agree, Kay. That drives me insane. I am gonna lose my mind. Okay, close enough, whatever. Whatever, welcome back, Jennifer. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing great. 
Hope you're doing amazing. I think we need a rug. We need a rug. We need a rug. Um, these rugs are cute, but they're like kind of a lot. Kind of a lot. And this is green, but like it kind of matches the bedspread more. Why don't I use her actual thing? Hello? Hello? Use her actual rug, Peyton. Dumb. The, they're so cute, the Hawaiian rugs. But I, yeah, I can't make them work either. Especially the rugs are hard in like the villager on your island houses because they're so small. <laughs> so it's the whole room. It's really like the whole room. Which is fine, but it's like a look, you know? It's like a look. It's like kind of a thing. Um, I want this thing too. Oh no, she has her own tea set. She, doesn't she have her own tea set that she has? And this thing has her own tea set. She's got her own brand. She's got her own brand. Where is it? You would think it would be with the other tea items. It's not. Because it's a special item. Because it's down here. Ah. Look at her with her specialty tea set. She's fancy. Give her some music. Oh my god, I forgot. There's like never any music. I should give her some music. Maybe, I don't know where. Maybe I'll put like back here. I'll put like a radio or something. A radio or something. Ooh, I want like a cute, a cute thing. Dex, are you okay? What are you doing? There's nothing at the door. Your dad is not going to be home for another hour. There is nothing here. He's so cute because Alex is always in this room. So whenever I take him in, because Alex works like a normal person, like a like nine to five-ish schedule. And when I take Dexter in from our walk in the morning, he always runs into this room because he thinks Alex is going to be here. And then he's always sad because he's not here yet. <laughs> I'm like, no, buddy, he'll be here soon. Not yet, though. I'm so sorry. I always feel so bad. I'm here, though, Dexter. It's okay. I'm here. You love me just as much, right? I think I want this one. Great. Oh, let me put music on. We don't have the music. We have the lo-fi beats. We have the lo-fi beats, which, are they still on? They are. Um. I just give her the birthday music. I don't know. Don't forget to like the stream. Yes, if you haven't already, you could. Um, I heard a rumor that if you like the stream, you click the like button, the number goes up by one. So... That's kind of cool. I'm just giving her bubble gum. I'm giving her bubble gum, KK. You know she likes it. You know she's into it. Whatever. Do, 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 do. I don't know what else to put here. I could put like more tea, tea, tea cups, tea things, tea items. Maybe another tea set. She is the teacup queen. Or just like other cute things that works too. Or you could click it three times for a very satisfying feeling. Yeah, or you could. You're right. You know what, you're correct. Do I need something here? I always put like a nightstand. Do I need a nightstand? I think, um, I might hate how this looks. I might not. I feel like I do this in every house. It's just, nope, there's no room. Okay, cool. The game decided for me. The game decided for me that, uh, there is no room. I don't know if you talk to your dad, but you can do anything for Hot Father's Day. I live in a different state than my parents. So I'm sending my dad good vibes. Sending my dad good vibes and lots of love. But I live in a different state than them unfortunately. So I actually don't know the next time I'll be home and I'll be able to see them. 
it's a little hard for me to get home. My parents are so great, they come into the city to come pick me up to bring me back home because I cannot take the public transport by myself because I am um, chronically ill and I have some problems with mobility still, especially like going up and down stairs and stuff by myself. I can do it, but it causes me a lot of pain and I just get a little bit nervous. Uh, I still have some like medical PTSD, so I get a little nervous to go places myself just in case there is a emergency and I um, uh, don't want to be by myself. They come and pick me up, which is super nice, but it's very far. You can put a rug underneath if you need to divide it and fill it up. Yeah, I could do that too. Could do that too. I'm like so over this room. I've got to the point where I'm like, ugh. Ooh. It's, it's fine. It's cute. I'll look back at it later and I'll be like, oh, this wasn't that bad. But I'm kind of like, all right. I wish there was an elephant toy. That would be cute. That'd be kind of cute. The bunny's fine, though. She can have a nice little bunny. She, she has a little bunny. Bunny baby. Okay, I'm going to move on to the lights and the um wall. Metal truck? Yeah. Medical truck is so real. Just want to say, send, sending you love. Thank you so much. Yeah, like, I know I'll be fine. Like, I do end up having to go places myself, but it's like... If I'm going into a place where I gotta take a lot of stairs, I gotta like get on a train, I'm not doing that by myself. No. I know I'll probably be fine, but. Mm -mm. No. Mm. This is Chai's house. This is Chai's house. Yeah. I'm just like, no. Let me make things easier for myself and just like not do that. Mm. Definitely understandable. Yeah, especially because, like, you know, when I found out, I didn't, like, find out I had endometriosis in a cute way, you know? I didn't, like, go to the doctor and be like, hey, I'm kind of not feeling well. And then they were like, oh, you have endometriosis. It was like, no, I got to the point where it was so severe I had to go to the ER and I couldn't move. And that happened in, like, a very public place. And if my boyfriend wasn't there, I don't know how I would have been able to, to handle that. Because I literally needed to be dragged out of an H&M. I couldn't have done that by myself. What? No. Mm -mm. So maybe it's a little bit irrational on my part. Like maybe I need to like get over it a little bit, but I'm not over it yet. It's only, it hasn't even been a year. So I'm not over it just yet. And so I try and just make things not scary and easy for me when I can. You know, I don't think there's anything wrong with that. This is Chai's house. Chai's house. Our little teacup baby. Our little teacup friend. It's our girl Chai. It's our gal. I think I'm gonna do the tea sign. I have the little sign. Doing that. Great. Almost done with this. And then I think we're gonna do some more villager photo business. Villager photo. I always put a clock here. I don't know why. It just screams clock. Like right above the the door just screams clock. Like, you know? Cute. Mm, that works too. I do that too. <laughs> it's just easy and it's nice. It's easy and nice and there's nothing wrong with it. Okay. Oh, the tapestry is great. Easy easy stuff. I wish there were more variants of this one. Like, I feel like this one could be so cute, but I just never like any of the variants. Unfortunately, I'm never that into them. So you can see how late you're going to be as you're leaving. Yeah, for sure. That's me in real life. Hmm? You know? Actually, we don't have a clock. Hmm? Just our phones, but you know. Moves blanket on couch, doesn't realize Kai is under said blanket. No! Kitty! Sorry, little baby. Sorry, little baby. You've got to move. I need the blankets. That's me every night when I come to bed, because I come to bed at crazy times like a psychopath. Um, and Alex already has all of the blankets, so I like have to wait for him 
to roll over and then I just take all the blankets. Because I don't want to move them off of me first. I feel bad. Poor kitty baby never disturbed the cat. <laughs> we scared each other. I mean, you both deserve blankets though. I'm not going to say you don't. Hey, Satan. I love the island. I think Van Gogh would approve. Aww. <laughs> oh, no. Maybe he'd even send an ear. Oh, no. <laughs> Thank you, Paul. I appreciate that. It's been really fun. I'm going to miss this island for sure, but we had certainly a lot of fun working on it. So I'm excited to do something next. I hate everything I'm doing. We're speed running this. I'm speed running this interior. I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> I'm over it. I'm over it. Okay. Great. Perfect. Lovely. Amazing. Chai has a house. Great. Cool. Done. Pepe's done. Hello, Mr. Nook. Is that a compliment or a threat? <laughs> it's up for interpretation. One pitcher plant's enough. There are each. I bet. You know I can't keep anything alive, Jen. I can't. I can't do it. Not me. Not me. Okay. Great. Cool. Alright, let's go to the next day. Do I like banana peppers? I have no idea what a banana pepper is. Did I win the thingy? I won round one of the thingy. Um, I'm in round two of the thingy. Hey, sweetie, Steph, just stopping by to say hello. Oh no, you and your daughter have uh, the Ovid. I'm so sorry, I hope you feel better. I hope you feel better, we're sending good vibes for you. Seeing you and your sweet voice has made my day. Oh, you're so sweet. Oh, I hope you feel better. Can we get some hearts for our friend Pistachio Queen? I'm so sorry to hear that. Yikes, yikes, yikes. I hope you guys don't have it too bad. I hope you don't have it. I yes, I won the first round, the second round. To be scheduled. To be scheduled. After this. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, villager photos, but aren't you kicking? Yes, I need, so that's what I'm doing. I am gonna kick them out if I've already gotten their photo. Because I'm so close to finishing this island. This island's gonna be done in like two days. But I need to kick someone out for Sabotage League. I'm only gonna kick someone out if I've reached max friendship level with them. Because I'm not trying to restart this friendship game. And now I've screwed this up for myself and I've done most of the villager interior. So I can only kick out someone whose interior I haven't done, which is Ione, Poncho, Sky, and Sherb yet again. That's it. I did the rest of them, I think. So options are limited. Right? I did everyone else. I did everyone else. I'm not missing anyone, am I? Yeah, because we did blueberries today, too. I made this difficult. Well, if it happens after... I... That's why I'm, like, kind of in limbo here. I'm like, well... if As long as it hap The sabotage leak happens... If it happens tomorrow, I gotta... Then I gotta figure it out. But if it's gonna happen later in the week... This island's gonna be done tomorrow. So it's like, after I film the island tour and I get their pictures, it doesn't matter. You know what I mean? Hi, Devon. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. I know, poor Sherb has to be... He's probably not going to ask to move out, though, because I just brought him back. So, yeah. Let me go in here. Let me get some things to gift people. And, uh... Yeah, I think I'm in August now on the game. Or July. Cacti and succulents are the gateway plants. See, I have I have so many, but I also killed them. So, I did a bad job. I know this already. Yeah. We're gonna just do this, I think, the rest of the time. That was my plan anyway. Villager interiors and this. We did most of the villager interiors. We cannot do any more. We're talking to plants? No. Why? You don't like plants? I can't keep them alive. I can't. I wish. It's because plants need light, and I know there's no light in this apartment. In this room I'm in, there is, but it's a million degrees in this apartment all the time. 
all the time. <gasps> you have 80 house plants? Okay. Plant tour? <laughs> Can we get a plant tour? Oh my god, that's so funny. It's a sickness! <gasps> Oh my god. Yes, we have another plant queen here in K. Oh my god. You and Jen. Plant plant besties. Plant besties over here. I wish. I so wish I could have like a luxury sun-filled apartment with like beautiful plants everywhere. And I can you have like 300? That's too many. That's a full-time job. That's literally <laughs> too much time. You guys spend so much time. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I have multiple plant life. My window is filled. We had a couple plants going strong for a while, but then we both just... Mm -mm. We were trying to grow like spices and like herbs too. Didn't go well either. It's too hot. It's too hot. Our, we live on like um a third four floor walk up and it's like the heat is always crazy but then there's also not sun it's always dark not ideal and also i forget about things so like i'm not watering the plants very often just checking in on y'all hope you have a great day thanks for being here devon i hope all is well with you thank you so much my friend okay but i overwatered the oh no i overwatered the cacti and the succulents I'll overwatered them. Cough, cough, grow lights. Okay. How am I going to grow lights? <laughs> Since I got sick, I reset my island. Give me something fun to do. I'm on the couch. <gasps> are you, you going to do any specific theme? I know. Overwatering kills them. I know, and I'm stupid. I did that. <laughs> you have one spoiled cactus. I have a couple. I got a couple I got to, like, throw out because they're not looking so hot. I have tomato plants and they take my day so I can't imagine 300. Mm -mm. That's too much. That's too many. Mm -mm. Most people kill plants with yes too much love aka water. That's me. Just gave the plants too much love. Okay. At least if I give Dexter too much water he doesn't have to drink it. He just leaves it. He doesn't want it he leaves it and it's okay. Maybe tropical. It's been all country lately, so something different. Tropical would be fun, especially for the summertime. I think that would be nice. I think that would be pretty nice. Can't even keep a fake plant alive. Same. That's that's a mood. I happen to agree with you. I happen to agree with you. You gotta get a peace lily. You can water that thing a lot and it loves it. Okay. Alex told me I can't buy another plant. He was like, Peyton, I've watched you spend so much money on plants that you instantly kill. So I gotta, like, get good. I gotta, like, get good. I gotta get good. Okay. I mean, this is probably fine for now. You killed a bunch at the part of the process. Okay, well, I mean, you gotta start from somewhere. You can't be a plant master right off the bat, I guess. It takes time, it's a skill. It's a skill. It is a skill. I, I know growing up, I had a bamboo plant and I always killed it. It always came back, but I always killed it. That's how you learn. Yeah, but do I have it in me? I don't know. Do I have it in me? Like this one person gave me a succulent and said it's low maintenance and I said, challenge accepted. That's a vibe. I have one that's in our bedroom that's still alive. It's doing, I haven't watered it in so long, so maybe it's dead. Maybe it's dead. I don't know. Look at Dexter. I can manage the dog though. I can manage the little puppy. The little pupper, he's doing good. He's doing all right. Oh, I have mail. I have mail. I think I just have like letters from villagers I haven't opened. Bamboo plants go dormant, so I don't think you killed it. Oh, really? Fake plants it is. Yeah. Maybe if I like have a house one day and I have like room 
And I can put the plants somewhere I can see them other than like a tiny corner where they're inaccessible. Maybe. I can do it. All right, I got a woodshed this music before I leave tonight. Oh, best of luck, Kay. Break a leg, break a leg. I'm going to be day. I am going to be DMing you after this. I'm going to be DMing you. See if you'd like to form an alliance with me. Up to you. You could say no, Peyton. I'm going to just send you my list. And then if you want to send me your list, you can. But you don't have to if you don't want to. But best of luck, bestie. Hope all is well. Fake plants just collect dust. Well, you got to dust them. You should dust them. <laughs> yes, those eyeballs. Yes. Pay and K for the win. Pay and K for the win. Tell me I'm wrong. Listen, I'm mentally prepared. I got to be mentally prepared. I'll be prepared, okay? Look at all of these. The, if the villagers don't give me their photos after these lovely presents I'm giving them, how dare. Shocker. Real plants collect dust, too? I don't know why that is shocking to me. Hi, Brynn. Welcome in. I hope you're doing good. Bold of you to assume I do more than replacing my air <laughs> No, I'm the same way, because we didn't even clean our air conditioner for so long, and we looked in it, and it was, like, all mold. We had to throw it out. We're like, oh my god. Replace your air filter, kids. It's important. Otherwise, you've been probably breathing in mold. And that's not good. It's not too good, is it? Alright. Let's go. Villager photos. Okay, today. Tomorrow's stream, remember I was supposed to start this stream at 10 a.m. and then I didn't because I wasn't feeling good? Tomorrow's starting at 10 a.m. Tomorrow's starting at 9 a.m. We got so much stuff to do. Hey, Alex, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. You interact with real plants, though, like watering, so it moves all the time. Oh, I guess that makes sense. Guess that makes sense. That makes sense. Hope you're doing good, Alex. Welcome in. <gasps> Naomi. Naomi. Bestie. Well, hello there, Mula. Hello. Our furnace won't turn on if we don't replace the filter. Well, there you go. Well, there you go. Well, there you go. All right, Naomi. It doesn't matter if you give me your picture. Can't move you out. But I need everyone's picture anyway. I need them all. Come on, bestie. Come on, bestie. Arrangement. It's arrangement. So we can't start the next island until I do all this anyway. And I've spent, I don't want you guys to think I just do this on stream. The amount of hours I've spent doing this off stream is like a lot. Will I be doing this the whole rest of the day? Yeah. Yeah. Actually, I think. Mm. Never mind, never mind. I usually go until 4.30 on days like today, but I was going to say, what if we just go to 4 and then I hop on a call with my mods if you're available. We could talk through some things, but maybe later. I got to think about some things before we even talk about it. Welcome back, Jennifer. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing good. So we'll probably still go to 4.30 or whenever Alex gets home, which is usually 4.30. Hey, Moonlight. Hey, Peyton. How are you? I'm doing good. How are you? Welcome in. Welcome in. Just eating lunch. Yeah, I'm starving. I'm so hungry. Sky? <sighs> What'd you have for lunch? Sky? Why didn't you give me your picture? Okay. 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 Doing good. Just ate some food. Oh, everyone ate. Um... No, I don't hope his subway breaks. Noah? No, no, no. We want him to get home safely and soundly. Safely and soundly. Especially because he's not feeling good. So, he deserves all the good things. Um, There's something else I'm supposed to do today, too. Don't remember what it is. Something else I'm supposed to do. I don't remember. I don't know. Talking about my boyfriend, because I said that the stream ends when he gets home. Hug Alex. <laughs> I'll let him know. You know what he said? He said, um, 
he said that he thinks by the end of 2022, I will hit, a, I think he said 15,000 or something crazy like that. And I was like, you are so supportive, delirious, delusional. But I was like, oh my God, you think that I could do that? And he was like, yeah, I think you could do more than that. He's like, that's just my safe estimate. And I was like, oh my God. I already have Ione's picture. So, Ione, Lolly, and uh, Sherb, I don't need to do. So we just need to find Doc Bluebear Poncho. Bam. And that's it. Isn't that so nice though? I was like, <laughs> I was like, sweetie, you're delirious, but, um, but thank you. But that's support right there. That's support right there. Uh, you can't village a hunt for Chai. Chai is only through amiibo cards, my love, so don't, don't, don't village your hunt for Chai. You're never gonna see her. <gasps> you can see 10,000. I can't. That's, an, that's too many. That's ridiculous. It's too many. Listen, the 2.6 is already a lot. Sounds like a good guy. He is. He's a babe. He's a babe. Give yourself more credit. Listen, that's a lot. It's a lot. Yeah, Chai can only be swiped in from an amiibo. Hey, Poncho. Hi, Poncho. Give me up. Oh my god, you use 700. No Sweetie. Hun. Huh, no, all of the Sanrio characters. <laughs> oh my gosh. Crazy. I'm sending you good vibes. I'm sending you great vibes. Tomorrow, um, it'll be 10 a.m. for me. I don't know, isn't this house horrible? I didn't do this one yet. I don't know, look at this house. Why is it like this? Why is it like summer camp realness over here? I hate it. I don't know why it's like this. It's horrible. I don't know why this man won't give me his picture. Giving him lovely apples is a gift. Giving him all the lovely apples. <laughs> Guys, if I brought rolled onto this island, then I'd have less of a chance to see a penguin on my next sabotage week. <laughs> Those minus five for the penguins? I'm sorry. I hate it. Mm. Why? I know. Why are there six beds in there? Who said that was okay? Now I'm thinking. I'm thinking about it. I scan in all of the penguins. I don't know. He's greedy. He wants more than one bed. He wants more than one. Hey, guess who became a mod for the first time? Oh my God, if you don't mind telling me who you a mod for, it's exciting. That's so exciting. He does like a sum slumber party. Okay, at least he's giving me flooring. I feel like as soon as they give you a wallpaper of flooring, you're like almost there. You're almost there. Doc, I thought we were besties, buddy. Give me your freaking picture. I want your picture. All right, Blueberry, you're our last chance. Oh no, bam, too. Bam, and Blue Bear. Last chance. And then, yeah, tomorrow I will be streaming at 10 a.m. I will be there. We will be finishing the island in tomorrow's stream. So, it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. Um, you're a mod for an ACNH streamer called Midna TT. She's a smaller, lesser known streamer, but her and her husband are amazing. Oh my god, I don't know them, but I'll have to check them out. That's awesome. He likes slumber parties, but it's just him. That's kind of creepy. Maybe that's sad, though. Maybe he doesn't have any friends. That's kind of sad. You know? It's kind of sad. Multiple beds is good. No! But he could get hurt jumping from bed to bed. I don't want him to get hurt. He's a little baby. Delete all villagers amiibo. Also, all the penguins. Yeah, perfect. Autofill Island. Oh, a VTuber like Barry. Oh, cool. I don't know them, but I'll have to check them out. That's awesome. Congrats, my friend. Congrats. That's awesome. That's awesome. That's awesome. 
Is there a bug on me? No, there's not. And I just had hair on my chest. I was like, what the heck? One bed for each day of the week. <laughs> Why am I getting mariachi clothing? Why? Maybe just a bed per day. Maybe. He alternates, you know? All right, bam is our last chance. And then we'll keep going. I'm not even listening. I don't know what you just said, Blue Bear, but okay. But okay, hun. Whatever. Whatever. Bam, you hun. And he sleeps on the floor one day a week. <laughs> I gotta keep all six beds when I remodel his interior. I'm gonna have to do that. I might do the rest of the interiors off stream after I kick someone out for tomorrow. For whenever. Bam. He sleeps on the floor on Sundays. Sounds like a party to me. Sounds like a party to me. Monday to, Monday to Saturday sleeps on each bed. Sundays on the floor. I've been five hours sitting on my desk watching you. Oh my god, really? Amazing. That's dedication right there. Ugh, give me your picture. Someone's gotta give me their picture, right? Like, someone's gotta. Someone's gotta. One. We're almost at 130 likes, guys. If you haven't already liked the stream, I heard a rumor if you click the like button, the number of likes goes up. Isn't that nuts? You hit your 40th HHP home last night. Oh my god, congrats. Who was your 40th home? So sorry I hit my microphone, by the way. I was surprised you're still live. I'm here. Tomorrow will be longer. Tomorrow I have to finish everything. Today I got distracted again. I keep getting distracted. I keep getting distracted. Yeah, we're gonna be done soon-ish. I don't know if I'm gonna go up until he gets home. I'm stressed. I got some stuff to think. I got some stuff to think about. I got some strategies to make up. I've got some scheduling to do. I'm gonna hop on Discord, too, and the mods are free to join in as I talk through this. Or not. You all can, like, live your life, too. I'm gonna do it anyway. I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna- I need to talk about this. I think maybe we'll go one or two more days giving pictures, and then maybe we'll end, because then maybe we'll do a little raid. Pepe will eat some lunch. Pepe will schedule her sabotage league match and think about how on earth is she gonna win somehow i am do you ever just watch your villagers on my island meringue was working out and then stuff yes i love to just like vibe and see what they're up to did i go a day forward did i do it already or no i feel like i didn't i feel like i didn't i feel like i just closed the game and then it started back up is that true that's definitely true. That's definitely what just happened. Me too. Oh no, I did go a day in advance. I, listen, oh, I, I would love to go against K too. I would love to go against Pat though, because I'm like such a fan. I'm like such a big, like I'm such a fan girl. No, I haven't eaten lunch. I did eat breakfast, but like not that much. I wasn't feeling that good. I, I, I don't know. I like such a, I'm such a fan. So it would be really cool for me to like to get to go up against him. I changed the time. No, but started a new day. Because I'm talking to Isabel. Because I'm talking to Isabel. So it must be a new day. Hey, I'm good. Did you change your username? What was your username before, my friend? Hello, welcome in. Welcome in, welcome in. Welcome in, welcome in. I know, and I don't want K to lose. We're aligning together. I would love K to win. Here's my fantasy. Here's my fantasy. No, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, well, let's say I let's say I win this side of the bracket. So I say I beat either 
So say I, oh, creative crew. Okay, welcome back. Hey, what's up, what's up? Doc? Doc? We'll come back to him. Um, say I win against Crunchy and then I win against either K or Pat. Who do we want me to verse from the other side? Who would we want, who is your dream finale? Who is the dream finale? Who, who is it? It would be, keep in mind, the other side of the bracket is Snacks versus Blaine and Cora versus um, Olive's Crossing. Cora Mora for me. I would love that. I would love that. You and Kay. Me and Kay can't go to the finals together, though, because me and Kay would be the semifinals. If she beats Pat, then I go up against her. But I would have to beat her to go up against, in the finals, the other side of the bracket. So it would be, the finals could only potentially be me. Me versus Cora, me versus Snacks, me versus Blaine, me versus Olive. Kay and Cora. That'd be fun. Cora, Blaine. Yeah. Pat said he wanted it to be me versus Cora. How do I have a sloth next to my name? I think you were gifted a membership. I think you were gifted a membership. I would check your emails. Did she give me something? Did she give me something? I love Blaine though. I know. I would love to go up against him too. I'd love to go up against him. I'm just happy to be here. Happy to be here. But yeah, it's gonna be good to know what the sabotages are though. That'll be good. Any leg up I can get, I'm trying to do it. I'm taking it seriously. Um, Doc is gone. Where did he go? Did you stop thinking? Doc, are you gone? There's Sherb. There's Sherb. I already have his. I almost feel like it has to be Blaine after his his frogs, dogs, coconuts in the chat. I know. I would love to go against Blaine. Are you still thinking? Don't move. You can't move. You're not allowed to move. No. No. Don't go. Not you. Not you. Give me your picture. Don't leave. He is such a troll. Like, I just redesigned your house. I give you presents every day. I talk about how much I love you and this is how you repay me. Like, how dare you? How dare. How dare. We're gonna have to spam penguins in Pat's chat because he was sending me so many ducks in my chat. I'm sending him all the penguins. Blaine, oh, Blaine is such a troll too. Him too with the ducks. Like, excuse me, we're fully doing Frogs, dogs, coconuts. I won't even tell people I'm there. Just like spam everyone's chat with frogs, dogs, coconuts. I don't even need to like say hi. They'll just know. Frogs, dogs, coconuts. <laughs> Everybody's a troll. I also. I'm not. Never mind. That's top secret information. Never mind. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Um, okay, we got Chai we have to gift, and she's not home. Great. We've got Sky, and she's not home. Great. We have to gift Blue Bear is the only one left, and Bam. Blue Bear and Bam. <laughs> None of those are any good points either now. Chickens, ducks. Oh, Poncho, we have to gift. Sorry, I just took a nap. No worries, no worries. I hope it was a nice nap. Hope it was a nice nap. What are the ones that are zero points? The ones that are zero, what are the ones that are zero points? The ones that are zero points are, oh, the good ones from last time. Frogs, dogs, and pigs. 
Gotta go get ready for work. No worries, Jen. So much love, my friend. I hope you're doing good. I hope you're having a good day so far. Much love. I'm only gonna go for a little bit longer. So don't worry. You're good. Not the chickens. Not the chickens. I'm just glad it's not the mice that are worth zero because I saw so many mice last time. Much love, Jen. Guys, go check out Jen on Instagram if you haven't already. Frogs, dogs, coconuts can live on Blaine, Blaine and pa uh, blah, 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 Blaine and Pat's chats. I agree. I agree. I did not take a break. But I'm going to end. I think I'm going to do one more day of gifting these things and then I'm going to go. Because I'm hungry and I am tired. I know the only time I'll be happy to see a gorilla. For sure. For sure. You need a nap again. I need a nap. I don't have time to nap. I gotta kick out a villager. I gotta kick out a villager. I gotta do all this stuff. I gotta finish the island. <gasps> it's a cuckoo week. It's a cuckoo week. I tease my son when he tells his villagers they can't leave. Enjoy your stay at Prison Island. <laughs> I love that. That was me when Walker lived here. Because he lived here since the beginning of my game. And I was like, you're never leaving. And then I eventually let him left leave. And now I'm sad. I'm always sad about it. Ooh, what was that? Oh, drinkable cookies. Thank you for the drinkable cookies. <gasps> yes, I'm so hungry. I want to drink all the cookies. All right, Blueberry, don't mess around. Give me your photo. I'm not trying to mess around here. Oh, Pappy's streaming. Oh, is he streaming right now? Is he streaming right now? I like the theory that Walker is lucky before the accident. Me too. <laughs> I like that too. <gasps> Bluebear's photo! Let's go! Let's go! Nice! That doesn't help me out that much because I already did her interior, but hey, we're one step closer. Let's go! Oh, he's streaming? Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I'll probably hang out there after this. No, Maddie, I'm so sorry to hear you're sick. I hope you feel better. I hope you feel better, my friend. Oh, there's Bam. He's down there. All right, we're going to do... We're going to talk to Bam, put the photo in my house, and then do the next day, and then I think that's going to be it. I think that's going to be it. Some apples. Wow, thank you for the tortoise specs. Wow. Wow. I know, I'm so happy I got her photo. Exciting. How do you get people's photos? You become their best friends. So you give them a lot of stuff. Give them a lot of hard work, talking to them, and giving them stuff. I'm so happy I got her photo. All right, at least that's another one. Another one that we got. We got. So, a lot of fruit. I did assessed fossils too. Foster check. I'm in pain, so I'm just gonna be like this. This is just, this is better for me right now. That's the thing with the posture check is like, it's good, but also sometimes when the pain level hits, it's like, this is all I got right now. This is all she has. But that's okay. Blue Bear's picture! <gasps> let's go. Let's go, let's go. It's gonna be worse. I, maybe. Maybe. It's. I feel like I can't straighten my torso right now. I feel like I can't do it right now. Um, who, what order did they move in? Poncho, Ione, Sky, Naomi. Oh yeah. She skipped the line. She skipped the line. I know, look at all the blue babies next to each other. They're so cute. Blue bear. <sighs> nice. Those are all the villagers I used to have. Yep. They're all there. Yeah, go slow and take it easy. Yeah, we're good. We're going to finish this strong. We're going to do this last day. That's going to be it for me for today. I'll be back tomorrow. Be back tomorrow. Alex hasn't even left work yet either, which is weird. What day of the week is it? Wednesday? Is it Wednesday? I think it is. Okay. Nope. <laughs> Not 
30 today. Not today, next week. Next week. Mm hmm Yeah, you can get the poster of them as soon as you they move to your island. You can or if you amiibo them, you take a picture of them at Harv's photo studio, then you're able to order picture uh, uh, posters of them. So I do the poster on the wall in order of when they moved in, and then I get all their photos in order that I got them. But I miss, in the beginning of the game, I didn't get everybody's photo because I didn't really know that was a thing. So I don't have every single villager I've ever had, had, had's photo, but I have every single poster of every villager I've ever had. And most of their pictures, so. Now I don't let them leave the island until I get their photo. Every day I keep watching Glee. It's a good show. It's a good show. I feel like I don't have the luck to get two in a row, but maybe. Maybe. Now we've gotten four of them, so almost half done with it. So that's good, at least. Hello there. I want all the pictures. I want all the pictures. Give me everybody's picture. Give me everybody's picture. Okay, thanks. Okay, thanks. All right, someone give me a picture. So now it's good. I don't have to go to Blue Bear. I don't have to go to Miss Blue Bear anymore. But uh, I still need to go up to Na Naomi and Bam's house are like the ones all by themselves. So I have to like mentally remember to go there first. I need to always go to Naomi's first because otherwise I forget about her house. Gigi told me recently that the wind was nice and she felt like it could carry her away. <gasps> I was thinking, so that means you're leaving, right? She's thinking about it, maybe. Maybe she's thinking about it. Naomi's home. Great. Naomi's home. All right, Naomi. Moolah. What you doing? At this point, do I just have every DIY? I feel like, at this point, do I have them all? All right, Miss Thing. All right, Miss Dexter, you okay? You all right, buddy? You okay, buddy? You okay? Dexter just like scared himself and like jumped up. Are you okay, puppy? Hey, monkey. How you doing, man? You doing good? This dog is the light of my life. He's the light of my life. Hi, are you coming to lick my ankles? Wow, thank you. Thank you, sir. Dexter's here to lick everyone's ankles. All the time. That's what he's here to do. My, my. Okay, give me your photo. Okay, it's a rumba dress. Room rumba. Not Roomba is the vacuum robot. Vacuum robot. All right. Realistically, I think Poncho will give it to me next, but it could be Sky. Sky, I think, could be next. Sky or Poncho for sure. I don't think Bam is ready to give me his photo, and I don't think Chai is ready to give me her photo. But I think. I think. Sky and Poncho. Aw, Blue Bear. She's so cute. And I own a cutie. All right, Sky. Oh, and Doc. Doc is never giving me his photo. Doc wants to move. Roomba. Is it Roomba? It's also pronounced Roomba. It's not pronounced Rumba. Roomba like the vacuum. Roomba. Oh, I'm stupid. Why did I think it was Rumba? Rumba, Roomba. Apple Sky, it's for you. Uh, 
It's for you, Sky. Is it your picture? No. But it's a wall, so we're almost there. It's a wall. I think I knew it was Roomba, but I just felt like my mind went to the vacuum. The bougie vacuum robot thing. I love Sky too. Here's a dress that was caught in my room. <laughs> I love when Doc is not wearing his regular glasses because his eyeballs are like so cute. They're just little dots. I guess you can have a <laughs> I guess you could. I guess you could. You why not? Alright. Some apples. Wow. Oh, Peyton. Great. Give me your photo. Bunny ears! That's cute, at least. That's nice. Well, isn't that sweet? Hey. -ya. Hey. -ya. All right. Okay. Um, Ione, we have already. We saw Blue Bear, who we have already. I know Doc gave me his ears. How do you kick villagers out? Talk to everyone that you like. Don't talk to who you want to move out. Time travel 15 days forward. Someone will have a thought bubble. If it's not the person you want, just time travel one day. Hi, Sherb. I have Sherbs already. Chai is still not home, and she should be, because I need hers. Let's just make sure she's not vibing back here. Sometimes she's in here. No, she's not. Okay. So I guess we're just looking for Poncho. And if we see Chai along the way. My island theme is Starry Night themed island. Like the painting. So it's all blue and yellow and stars. Blue and yellow and stars. Alright, I don't see Miss Chai hanging around. I really love your island. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. It's been a lot of fun. All right, Poncho's still home. Thank you, thank you. Vroom, vroom, vroom. There's a motorcycle outside. Vroom, vroom, vroom. What is he doing back here? Like, this is so sus. Why do you have so many beds? What are they for? What are they for? What are they, what are you doing with all of them? I'm scared. Okay, Poncho, give me your picture. Okay, I have, now I have Blue Bear, Ione, Sherb, and Lolly. So we've got six more. Everybody else we need. Okay, we just gotta talk to Bam. Bam and if we find Chai. That's it, that's gonna be it for me. Then I'm gonna get some food. Do some stuff. Do some stuff. Continue to do this the whole rest of the day. We talked to Doc already. Let me just see if anyone's hanging out around here. No. Do, 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 do. And we know Blue Bear we have already, and she's not even by her house. Let's see if Bam is home. Let's see if Bam is home. He is in front of his home, close enough. Bam, I got you a present, baby. Give me your picture, baby. Give me your picture. Purple rose that says, I know, I'm keeping them all until um, literally right before I do the tour, and then I'm just going to dig them up all at the last minute. When you give them to the void with redecorated houses, do you get to keep that house? What do you mean? The house goes with the void, too. House goes with the void, too. Chai is your favorite. She's a good one. I love Chai, too. I love her. I didn't get the amiibo cards for a while, too. Green. Oh, look at us with the flooring. Everyone's giving us flooring. Everyone's giving us flooring. I didn't see Chai anywhere. Let me just run around by the plaza again to see if I miss her. Um, and then I think that's gonna be it, guys. I think that's gonna be it for me today. It's been five. It's been five hours. Tomorrow we'll do more. Oh, no, Decorated Houses via DLC doesn't carry over, unfortunately. Unfortunately, it doesn't. Yeah. 
Well, tomorrow's stream is gonna be the whole island, uh, stream doesn't end until I finish the island thing. I might finish the rest of the interiors of the villager houses off camera today. I can't decide if we're gonna do my house interior together or if I'm gonna just do that by myself. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. I don't even wanna do my interior TBH. I'm going to, but I kinda don't want to. I'm gonna, but I don't want to. There's Sherb again. Sherb again. I see no chai. I see no chai lady. It's flooring day for sure. For some reason. For some reason. All right, Miss Chai. You hanging out in the jewelry shop? No. No. All right. Um, Sky already did. Doc Lolly, we have. Da, 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 da. She's not on the beach. Oh, I put this in an innocent. No, you can still get through here. Um, let's see if she's by the museum. If not, she's like probably in the museum or inside the museum or like in a shop and I'm not gonna look for her. I am still live, but I'm about to end in like one sec. Yep, that's gonna be it. She's not around. Okay. All right. All right. We did the thing. Well, we didn't finish all the villager interiors. We've done most of them. We got... A lot of the villager photos so tomorrow's stream is gonna be at 10 a.m unless my schedule changes and i'll let you know as soon as i know um we started at 10 a.m well we're going to be starting at 10 a.m tomorrow for sure this time for sure this time and tomorrow's stream is the stream doesn't end until the island is done so it's gonna be fun it's gonna be fun um do i want to raid someone right now i don't know. Usually, I always do. I always do. I don't know. Because I'm probably not going to watch. I'm going to, like, instantly go and eat some food and stuff. And I always feel bad about raiding and dashing. I think we're going to just call it here today, if that's okay. Because... I'm gonna just, I gotta get some food. I just gotta get some food today. But we'll do a raid next time for sure. And I love you guys all. Thank you all so much for hanging out. I stay tuned for fun, exciting stuff coming up some point soon. Stay tuned. Thank you guys for hanging out with me. Thank you for bearing with me, kind of not feeling that good today. And thank you for hanging out and having a good time. And there are lots of people streaming right now. So even though we're not doing a raid, you can go send your love to some of our friends that are live. I see Pat is live. I see that Sierra and Danny and Camille are live as well. So there are tons of other people going stream right now. Go ahead and send them love. Much love to you guys. I'll see you in the next one. And 